Hello, hello. Hello, everybody. Friday, everybody. It's Friday. It feels like an eternity since I last did this, even though it's only been since Monday. And that's because I got a little bit sick. You might even hear it in my voice just a little bit. I can't believe I'm actually streaming tonight. Usually when I get sick, it's way longer than a couple days. But here I am. Toughing it out. Not really. There's harder things to do in the world than sit in front of a computer, play video games with a camera in front of your face and a microphone, and you just keep talking. But tonight, that's exactly what I'm going to do, even though I'm not 100%. I think I'll be fine. I got the tea. We got the tea. We got the tissues. Hopefully, I remember to mute when I do that one. And uh, more importantly, we have ourselves a little bit of a change up tonight with some Diablo 4. Now, it's been a while, let's put it that way. I last played Diablo 4 just after its release, and I didn't play that long. Now, if you take a look here on screen, I've got this character right here, a Necromancer, which I had a decent time with, I'm not gonna lie to you, you know? But as you can see as well, I've only made it to level 45, and then I quit. Yes, I'm a quitter. But that's only because at the time, Diablo 4 was so boring to me and honestly so slow. Now, a lot more changes are going to be coming into Diablo 4 in, I think, just a few weeks, maybe a month, whenever that new Season 4 comes out. But I figured we jump in now. There's been some changes recently, and I think some pacing changes. I think it's quicker to level. Um, and more importantly, I've been playing a lot of Last Epoch recently, which means... I'm probably going to perceive Diablo a little bit differently now that I've been playing another ARPG for so long. So tonight we're going to experience for ourselves what Diablo 4 is like in its current state, what we think the new changes might do for it, for where it's at, and also just have a chill time. Like I said, I'm not 100% tonight, so we're going to check out Sorcerer since we've been playing Mage in Last Epoch. I thought it'd be a cool way to come compare maybe uh the feel of each one which one i prefer to play in terms of a caster class and that's about it so let's jump right in and get going on some sorcerer in diablo 4 before i do that let me shut off this music here and we can get going now this is a new game as usual so for anybody catching this live let me know if the audio levels are okay Okay, I think we are good to go there. Pop that. Oh my gosh, I got so much going on. I just feel like in a different universe. I've been all drugged up on freaking NyQuil and DayQuil, you guys. That stuff is harder than the hardest of drugs. I'm telling you right now. If you know, you know when it comes to NyQuil and DayQuil. Especially the NyQuil part. I don't know about you guys, but I have the craziest dreams with NyQuil. It is wacky stuff. All right, so Diablo 4. Now, I did play this character up to level 10 um, just to kind of get ourselves going so I wouldn't start from scratch. I did skip the campaign, excuse me, which is new. I don't believe that was the uh, case for when this game launched that you could do that. So that was kind of convenient. So I'm just kind of in the mix of it now of whatever I want to do. Now there is, it looks like the Season of the Construct uh, focus quest, as you can see your season quest, which we can follow, or we can kind of do whatever we, we want, I think, in terms of leveling. So I kind of like that. I really do. Uh, it gives us the freedom. I've played before, so I'm not entirely lost. So let's get going on with some, I guess, random grinding. Now, one thing I was doing here, let me, I gotta get readjusted with some new keybinds here. For the abilities, I've decided to go all fire. Now, what I've been playing in Last Epoch is a completely fire mage rune master build. So I thought, why not if I'm going to do a mini comparison, like a not too thorough comparison, let's go fire in this and let's just see what I'm having more fun with. Of course, we're low level in this, so it's going to take us some time, but let's see what we can do. Right now, I'm working with the Hydra, which is basically a turret uh, of Hydras spitting out fire damage. Flame Shield sounds familiar from our last Epoch character. Firebolt and fireball so lots of simple abilities right now 
so far they feel okay but i'm not exactly impressed so i want to see if that changes tonight in the time we're playing here i'm trying to think of what i want to do maybe we'll try these season quests just to give that a shot so let me travel up here since that is technically new for me there's still so much in this game i haven't played though so we'll see how it goes Oh man, I'm I'm sipping on that better days tea. Got some turmeric going. Love me some of that kind of tea. All right, all right. Let's let's do the thing here. One thing I had to do. If you take a look down here, I switched the key binds to not be one two three four, but instead Q W E R. That's what Leap Last Epoch has done by default. And honestly, I can't go away from it now. Just because the one, two, three, four brings my hand way too high on the keyboard, and I do not like that. Uh, let's see. I guess we'll pick up some of these side quests too while we're at it. Full disclosure, I'm probably not going to be listening through here. Although, I will say Diablo 4 nails the voice acting and kind of environment visuals. I really do love this game, and it was such a shame for me to walk away from it. I do love a good old hellscape environment. I mean, who doesn't? Who doesn't? All right, let's see. Let's see what this uh, seasonal quest stuff is all about here. What I should be doing is grinding on some mobs, but, you know, we'll see if I actually get to that. Uh, zero, I can hop off. All right, let's see what we can do here. Got my fireball. So fireball does feel pretty powerful. It explodes, it seems like, on impact. Okay. Okay. Man, it just feels so weird to play such a similar game. Uh, but it's still so very different. Let's see, what do we need here? Elemental Core? Destroy this in, brazier, in a brazier to summon a Herald of Malthus. Okay. So I guess we got to find some of those Elemental Cores. Let's go into this hatch over here. I mean, there's going to be really no rhyme or reason to whatever path we choose tonight. So, I mean, let it be what it is. Although... By the way, guys, I already did a little bit of transmog, and I'm looking mighty fine. That's another thing. I'm probably going to be doing a lot of Last Epoch comparisons tonight, only because I've been playing so much of that game. But my golly, I look freaking good already, because that's one thing these games need more of, is transmog. It's so hard. What is going on? Unfortunately, this is not Season 4. Season 4, I believe, is in a few weeks to a month, which... Actually, I'm just going to verify that right now, only because... I'm curious. Season 4 apparently is going to have some pretty great changes. And we're going to have to check that out. Let's see, May 14th, so even further than I thought. Um, so we're about a month away, I guess, right? It's April. Bear with me tonight. I am like, after being sick for two days and still technically sick, I feel like my timeline of things, you could have told me a year has passed and I would believe you. Uh, let's see. Of course, I did that. All right, so we're back. So... I'm just trying to get a little bit of a uh, a taste of where Diablo 4 is at currently, you know? Also, good to see you, Izzard. I feel like it's been an eternity since we uh, last streamed and you were here, so good to see ya. Okay, level 11. We're moving quick now. I mean, that was one of my biggest gripes with Diablo, was like how slow the leveling was. So if we can just blast through this, honestly, that's what I want right now. That is A-OK -okay with me. Another thing I have to get used to as well is the fact that we have a, a dash, which after leveling this character up to 10 uh, the other night, I was thinking to myself like, man, I actually don't miss having a dash in an ARPG after playing one that doesn't have one. Only because I feel like the dash in this just feels like so bad. Like it, you don't feel like you go anywhere. It's such a small little mundane thing. And it has such a long cooldown that it literally means nothing to me. All right, let's check out our skill tree, by the way, too, to give everyone a little taste of what I've gone with. Now, this is totally on a whim. As usual, I'm not going to use a build guide or anything like that. We're going all fire. We're going to be a pyro. And um, so I'm just kind of winging it right now. Fireball seems like a good thing to stack. We have our flame shield and Hydra. I'm really curious to see where we end up going here. Um, but yeah, I... I I have a feeling this is going to get a little bit more ugly than even my last epoch winging it, but we'll see. 
And a nice little touch here. We got our Pyromaniac as our little tag because, you know, we know who we are and we roll with it. All right, let's see here. So I don't exactly know what's going on with these brazers. I guess I have to do something. It looks like if we go farther down here, we'll be able to uh, maybe complete the quest. And right now, it seems like Fireball is my like blast ability. It explodes on impact, but then my Fire Bolt is more of like my freebie easy ability. And then it applies damage over time through like burning. So that kind of feels nice. Is our, yeah, been busy? Oh, man, that's okay. We all have our freaking lives. You could show up, you know, six months from now, and I'd still be as joyful as if you were in every stream. Busy's good, though. I hope it's a good busy. Hope it's not a bad busy. That's, uh, I feel like I've been super busy, too. I just, I did a little trip last weekend, which is why I think I got sick. What's going on here? Okay, here here we go. Okay, this is our quest then. We just have to like close those things down. Yeah, I feel like every time I leave New York, and the irony is, is New York has so many germs, but every time I leave, I feel like I get sick. And usually when I leave, I'm not going to another urban area. I'm going to like the open space of like somewhere outside of the city. What is going on over here? Anything over here? Nothing. So that's just kind of how it goes. I feel like our bodies adapt to like certain germs. And then once you change it up, no matter how heinous they are, if they're normal germs, your body's just like so cool with it. All right, what do we got here? This slain one. Oh, no, there's nothing. Oh, this guy. My perception tonight is going to be wacky. Like I said, I'm blaming the NyQuil and DayQuil. It's an easy excuse. Spawn of the damned. All right, now we're getting... Now that we're playing Diablo again, we get some pretty dark enemies, dark environments. I'm all for it. Okay. Spawn our Hydra right here. Looking good, looking good. Let's see, two more waves. It's not too bad. I'm not going to lie, though. Ever since I like started playing this character already in the first 10 levels, it does feel like I am like, Out of mana. how do I put this? I dare I say it, dare I say it. It feels like the last epoch's gameplay is more flowy. And I know that that might sound crazy because I always thought as Diablo to be the best gameplay experience. And maybe it's just because I'm low level right now and I'm going from end game in last epoch to uh, leveling here, but I'm not gonna lie, it, it just, there's something slower about the Diablo combat that I'm feeling right now. And that's just all anecdotal, you know, it's all impressions, but man, I'm feeling it. Once again there too, I'm not even using my dash because I always forget at this point. Interact with this, sick. Get our Hydra down. Oh, I guess I'll use my dash now. I'm out of mana. Oh boy, out of mana too. Yeah, it just feels crazy, dude. Like, I just feel like, especially with the Rune Master Mage in Last Epoch, it just feels like such a constant flowy ability that you just get to keep popping it off, where in this, it's just kind of like so more, so much more stagnant for what I'm using right now. These, I don't look sick. Do I sound sick? I feel like I hear it in my head. I had like, luckily not the flu or COVID or anything, because that's always my fear. I feel like the last few times I've been sick, it's so long, but I just have, I think, a, a decent cold on my on my hands or in my head, I should say. How do I get? Oh my God, this thing's annoying. Let's get on our horse. Let's go back up there. I think we got to go back up here. Keep in mind, Diablo doesn't have a freaking uh, overlay map, so this is just our life now with this game. So such freaking nonsense. Uh, how do I get off this thing? There we go. Welcome, Indies, by the way. I am. So happy to see you. I uh, I had a feeling somebody, and by somebody I mean you, would call me out and say I wasn't sick. So I appreciate it, as usual. Little stuffy, you're still beautiful. <laughs> well, thank you, Deez. Thank you, thank you. I got the tissues on standby, guys. Got the tissues on standby. We got the tea rolling. We're feeling good enough to be uh, 
It's funny. I think before you guys showed up, I was, you know, talking to the camera as I usually do. What do I have to do? Find a way into the vault, copper, of Skaz Glen? I'm trying here. Um, I got the tea. I got the tissues. And I was talking as if, like, it was a hard thing. Wait, do we have to do this freaking thing again? What's going on here? I just did this. I was like, oh, wait, right. I'm not going to try and say it's a hard thing to be having a head cold while playing video games. Like, that just, that seems a little ridiculous. Like, there's literally people struggling in the world, and I'm like, yeah, it's going to be hard tonight, guys. I got to play a video game sitting still, and my nose is a little stuffy, you know? Sinuses are working me real hard. But nonetheless, how's everybody's week going, by the way? I was so excited to do the Monday, Wednesday, Friday this week, and then lo and behold, Wednesday becomes a sick day for me. I didn't even go to work the last couple days, so I truly was like down and out. I was like, no way, man. These days, I'm like, if I'm even a little bit sick, I don't go to work. Heck no, I gotta just get better. I'm taking one for the team with the hard work. <laughs> Thank you. It, your words, not mine on that one. This this really grueling, long hours, just grindy work. That's why I play ARPGs, you know? It's about the grind in real life and, and in game. That's what it's all about. All right, I can't believe we just did that twice. I have no idea why we had to do that. Um, let's see if we have any upgrades, because right now we're going to have a lot of upgrades, being that we just started here. Um... Oh, wait, lots of resistances here. Plus one fire damage. That is our freaking ring right there, huh? Resistance to all elements, poison, resistance, cold. Let's see, do I want cold or poison resistance? I guess it really doesn't matter right now. It really doesn't. Let's just toss this one on. Dude, I just I can't understate how weird it feels to be playing this game again. I thought I knew I would come back, but... Maybe I'm a little premature by coming back right now, but I don't care. I just, I wanted to change it up. Although I will tell you guys, I've been playing so much Last Epoch off stream. You have no idea. How's everybody else's runs going in Last Epoch, by the way? That's, I'm at almost 100 hours now, and I'm thinking about doing um, maybe a deeper dive into uh, my experience with it video-wise, but we'll see. My whole video script writing and weekly work kind of took the back burner this week to the uh, old, good old sickness I'm running through. D slacker, come on now. Come on. Actually, you know what? I asked for this last stream for people to be more mean to me, so I guess this checks out. That's a nice level of uh, meanness. Which actually... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, man, we're in it. We're in it. Hold on. I didn't expect that to happen. Dive out of that. Do we need more mana? Fireball takes too much freaking... Uh, Mana, as far as I'm concerned, what the hell is this nonsense? Out of mana. Yeah, shut up. I already noticed we're not going to get the same fool's voice line in this. We just get a really emo, dismal sounding bro here who wants to talk about being out of mana or that he can't do things. Come on, come on. Yeah, it just feels so like stop and go the freaking combat, dude. Why does it feel that way after playing uh, Last Epoch? Has anyone else like done the uh, the shift from Diablo to Last Epoch side by side? Because it does feel way different. As it should, by the way. As it should. Um, but I was speaking about people being mean. I don't know if anybody saw my recent clip. Uh, I put it on like shorts, TikTok, and so on. But um, see, where else do I got to go here? It was regarding the, the comment I made last stream about playing games and doing it the most chaotic way and the example i used was gta and like not stopping at stoplights when you play gta because that wouldn't be any fun and let me tell you something when i posted those i made a note not to tag grand theft auto because i knew i knew what would happen the gta fanboys would come out of the woodwork and they would freaking go ape shit on me because of it and lo and behold, some of the stragglers who didn't follow the uh, tag since it wasn't there found the video and started criticizing my terrible take on this as if like I truly meant it and it wasn't like 
just light banter and a little bit of satire. And I thought it was hilarious. But at the same time, I was like, oh my God. Like, I called this one, dude. And they were just all coming at me thinking I was actually projecting that they suck at games. I mean, that's that's the spirit of the internet in a nutshell, but I, I, I couldn't believe it. I thought I avoided it. Deez, I'm doing a Rune Master. Now you're addicted to Last Epoch. You have four level hundreds? Oh my gosh, I can only dream. Literally, I've been struggling to find time to play more Last Epoch, only because I've been like focusing on like Dragon's Dogma and like some of the channel stuff. I've been like trying to prep for future content and you know getting sick literally it pains me more than anything to go like i said last weekend i took a trip out of the city so obviously that takes time away from things i usually do for my routine who's this malthus yeah yeah that's a sick voice he kind of sounds like me right now or that's what i feel like i sound like but if only but the point i'm trying to make is i get so like salty when i have my routine disrupted even if it's for things I want to do. And uh, that's what I'm feeling right now. So I think uh, level 100 on my Rune Master is going to come sooner than later. Let's not hit that and get hit. Um, because, yeah, I just can't stop playing. It's, it's too much fun. And now that I'm really starting to understand the game through and through, like, even in the last play session I had, uh, yesterday I was playing since I was, you know, homesick all day. And... Man, like, we're starting to really mold our gear into something special here in Last Epoch. It's going to be a, a good showing for next stream that I play that. Let's see, get out of there. Out of One thing I'll probably have to remember here in Diablo 4 as a sorcerer is I'm not sure if there's going to be a way to make me super tanky like I do as mage in Last Epoch, but I have to be super mindful of that because that is one massive strength of the Rune Master or maybe mage in general in last epoch is the fact that it's so freaking tanky wait why are they immune what's going on here take these guys out take these guys out malthus is really uh whispering in our ear here um let's see we got some more points here when do we get to go down here one more point let's see should i max anything out i feel like i should be using flame shield more Let's look at some of these passive ones. Lucky hit chance. I forget exactly what that is. I'm pretty sure it's something along the lines of like, you insta-kill people after a certain percentage of their health is gone. I could be wrong on that, but I think it's something like that. You gain 3% damage reduction against elites. No, whatever. I don't care about that. Um, let me just add one to Flame Shield for right now. Why not? These, how's New York today? New York was pretty stormy, not gonna lie. All of, all of the things are coming together right now. It, it was like 70 the other day, which is crazy, which is why I think I got sick. So at first I thought it was allergies, but then I just legitimately got sick. And now it's like crazy stormy, which I'm totally OK with. I think I've said this before, but I'm a huge fan of overcast and like, you know, blistery weather outside. Like, I don't necessarily love sunshine and rainbows all the time. Uh, it's not exactly my vibe. That's why, like, when I lived in San Diego for a little while, I was like, dude, it's fucking Groundhog Day every day. I can't do this. Like, weather-wise, it is. Also, I don't know if you guys noticed, if you guys have played uh, Diablo recently. I'm assuming this was a part of, like, the season of the Construct, but I have this, like, Construct guy, this little spider thing. And we can actually, hold on, where can I change his equipment? Here it is. Um, and then you get to like add some abilities to them using like the core ability is like this, what do they call it? Governing stones. And then each governing stone provides three abilities. It looks like through tuning stones. So for example, I have like damage done by supporting skill by the supporting skill taunts enemies hit, uh, supported skills damage dealt is applied as lightning and supported arcing skill can hit one additional enemy honestly i haven't even begun to like explore that i'm just worried about like general gameplay and just leveling up this character for right now it's just kind of a nice to have having a uh, minion around but it seems like fairly cool i definitely don't hate it 
definitely don't hate it. Do I wear open toe sandals? No. Listen, let me tell you something. I've never worn sandals or flip flops in my freaking life, dude. There's something about it I do not like and I will never understand. And also, speaking of New York, if you wear sandals or flip flops on New York streets, you are an absolute psychopath. The amount of things that could touch your freaking feet, like, I don't know why anybody would want to freaking do that. Also, what's going on here? Why is this a hell house? Let's get out of here. Oh, that was actually kind of easy. Not a chance in the world. I will say the ambiance of Diablo 4 is also irreplaceable. Like, just this music in the background hits way harder for the environments. I feel like it really ties it together. I feel like that gets lost a little sometimes in Last Epoch. Come on. Take him down. I feel like I'm also using so many potions. I mean, I'm not judging myself tonight. Not with not with how I feel. No, don't do it. Don't do it. Denism. De Dennis M. Dennis M. Thank you. Thank you for that follow. By the way, guys, take the example set by Dennis here and uh, give the stream a follow on Twitch. If you haven't already, if you are a Twitch viewer, that is. We're also streaming live on YouTube. I'm trying to hit that 30 follower mark, which is, I think, not crazy. And I think we could do it, by the way. But welcome in, Dennis. Glad to have you here. If you are a fan of Diablo or ARPGs, we play uh, Last Epoch around here, and we're trying out giving a uh, return to Diablo. So welcome in, welcome in. Apologies you caught me on the uh, sick day, but you know. Nonetheless, I just sound uh, like I got a slightly deeper voice, which, you know, deeper voice, sexier voice. That's that's what they say. You know, I'm rolling with that. I don't even have to put the EQ on the microphone, you know, the low end don't even have to boost that tonight. I actually think the last time I streamed Diablo before I really started doing streaming more consistently in YouTube videos. I had just gotten this mic and I had no idea how to set EQ on microphones or anything. And I, it might even be on the YouTube channel now of me playing. And my voice sounds so low because I just bumped up the low end so much. It was like way too boomy. But you know, you live and you learn, guys. It's all a part of the process, they say. Honestly, it's definitely one of those things I wish I could... Uh, like, does anybody have, like, those, like, very specific things they wish they could change about themselves? Like, it doesn't even have to be that big of a deal. For me, I feel like just having, like, a super deep, like, radio voice, that would be so sick. There's something about that that seems, like, so nice to have. Like, those commentators, like, whether they're sports commentators or anything, they just have these voices that are just, like, so full and, like, they just, like, halt everybody in a room the second they speak I feel like that is such powerful stuff in a career in a career setting these thought you would show off no 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 we're not doing that tonight these hell no I i'm about to ban that word don't don't even make me we'll put that on the ban list so fast you'll you'll start getting timed out it'll be crazy and i don't want to do that these we like you around here. Yes, your hands. Tiny hands, large hands. Honestly, I feel like... I mean, maybe, maybe wishing for something is just like leaning into not being... Or not having self-confidence, but... For the sake of the fun of it, I feel like it's a, it's a fun conversation, you know? A crucial object is missing. Well, thanks. You don't say. Okay. Let's find our crucial object, shall we? And I forgot how much darker this game is, too. I freaking love it. Come on. Come on. Oh, I should probably... Uh, no. I, I forgot there's, like, those health pools, too. What's going on here? Yeah. 
But yeah, this just, man. I feel like everything I do takes, like maybe, is there like increased cast time in Diablo? I'm literally going to be talking about this game like I've never played it before, but man, it's been, it feels like an eternity. I got to relearn it. I know one thing I experienced when I hopped on this character to get them going last night was the fact that there's no like game guide like like there is uh, in Last Epoch. I got so used to just searching things up by hitting G on my keyboard that it kind of felt bad when I couldn't do it here. Maybe I'm missing the game guide in this, like if it is key bound somewhere else, but I couldn't find one. I feel like it's like a must have now. It just feels like it just is a no brainer. There we go, level 14. Also, I'm pretty sure at level 15, we can't try out new skills without paying to respec. So I might want to try some stuff out, although I was pretty dead set on the fire abilities. So I don't know about that. Let's see, we did open this new tree. We have meteor and firewall. I think I'm already leaning towards meteor because honestly, who doesn't want an ability called meteor? Your pyromancy skills deal 3% increased damage while you are healthy. What does healthy mean? Uh, healthy characters have more than 80% of their life. Honestly, I haven't been so healthy. IRL and in-game. But I do want that. Let's try out Meteor, though. Let's get a new ability. R roll in here. Let's freaking go. Deez, your hands are so messed up from being a diesel mechanic for 26 years. It would take a new s You would take a new set? That's fair. Honestly, I have... This is... I don't know if you guys will even be able to see... Let's see, does it even focus? This hand right here compared to like my right one is so like janky and dry and I have no idea why. Like I don't work in a, like a desk job setting. So it's not like, so there is like somewhat of an answer to it. But at the same time, it's like, there's no reason to, as to why it's that bad. Like I've done all the tricks, like wearing a glove with lotion in it. Also, how did we just become rich like this? This is crazy. Um, What's, oh man, wait, hold on. This game has to, it's freaking me out. All these like floor stuff, I always suck at avoiding. I'm not prepared for it. Um, yeah, I, I don't know why. Like my hand is like forever dry and honestly, it just feels bad, man. It feels so bad. If there's anything I could change, it would be that, a moisturized hand. I don't know, maybe it's the keyboard. I, I don't know, man. I feel like I've used the keyboard all my life and never had this issue. Let's see, what do we got here? We got to go a body stolen, a body made. Is this what we've been working on this whole time? I'm just rambling on. I'm actually really impressed with how my voice is holding up and like, it's kind of crazy. But today was my first day where I felt okay. So I went to work and uh, I actually did nothing at work. I'm going to be honest. I, I, I didn't really do much. Oh, this is our item. Sick. Okay, shut up, Malthus. Okay, relax, dude. Oh, speaking of hands, what would you take from me? Would you cut off my fingers? He said he's he's listening to our chat, guys. I did not turn on an extension to uh, have this guy in our chat, but here he is. Oh, he's going to cut his own fingers for us. Wonderful. That sounds lovely. Sounds very Diablo-esque. Uh, what's going on here? Who are we attacking? Speak with uh, Ayuzan in the gate hall. Wait, what, what even happened? Did we even do anything? I, I feel like I didn't even know what we were attacking and then all of a sudden we won. I will never die and I will never be small again. Okay, there's nothing wrong with being small, Malthus, okay? You know, it's all about the confidence, my friend. All about the confidence. All right, let's see what we got here. Any Anything good. What's a swift support upgrade? That sounds like something for like my construct guy. Let's check this out. Has anybody played uh, Diablo 4 recently with this construct? Because uh, this is totally new, man. I have no idea what this is. 60% uh, 60 per 60 of the supported skills damage dealt is applied as lightning. Wait, I already got that. Attack speed bonus. Maybe we'll do that. One additional enemy lightning skill. I'd rather have him not use lightning, to be honest. I want to use fire and fire only, okay? We are a pyromaniac, as our title says. We'll have to think of a new name. Oh my god, we have so much. Hold on, let me get out of here, and then maybe we'll focus on our uh, new gear here. Oh my gosh. 
Man, crazy. The only thing I hate about being sick, honestly, is the fact that like you sweat all the time. And there's nothing more I hate than like doing nothing and sweating. It's like, that's why I want to live in like Antarctica. I just never want to sweat again in my entire life. And I did play sports, but like there's a time and place to sweat and it's not playing video games. Let me tell you. Um, oh, transmog, by the way, let's uh, see what we can do to our our transmog here as an update, because these are new to me. Oh, look at that. Look at that. It almost looks like pigtails. Our boys rocking some pigtails with some confidence. That doesn't fit. I kind of like the crown, to be honest. The headdress. That's nice. The pharaoh looking one. All right, we don't have too much yet, but honestly, ooh, hoo, 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 that's a good one. I think I'm keeping that one. Anything else here? No, I think we're good. Honestly, like, look how sick we look, and we're literally, like, level 14. This is why transmog needs to be in every game. Uh, yeah, we'll save that. Sick. All right, stash, we obviously have nothing in it. All right, let's check out what we got here. Any, any good upgrades is my question. Let's see. This definitely seems like an upgrade. Let's... Equip that. Um, overpower damage, vulnerable. I really have to learn what all these mean again. Lightning damage, critical strike. Ooh, plus three fire damage. We already were working with one of these, right? Plus one to fire damage. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We got a nice little upgrade there then. Dude, honestly, did they improve the itemization since prior to the seasons because I don't remember getting so much good items if I'm being honest that was another one of my complaints with Diablo let's see do we want to use a staff or just use our uh right now we're using a freaking dagger I feel like that's probably not optimal but you know what it is what it is yeah because I I definitely don't it was too slow of leveling and I was getting no gear at all which is just like Literally dropping the ball in every way for an ARPG. Hence why I feel like Di Diablo has gone through I feared as much. the uh, nonsense here throughout its lifespan already. What's going on here? Constructs and traps have breached the surface near vault entrances. Defeat them to earn loot and a special currency? What's the currency? Loot obelisks to retrieve their cores. Immolate cores at elemental brazers to summon heralds of Malthus. Powerful elite demons that drop pearls of warding. All right. Pearls of Warding grant access to ward woven chests found within vaults. This is where, as like the semi casual I am with games, like when there's like so much, like a long list of things I have to keep track of as a new player, I'm just kind of like, is this fun or does this feel like a lot of work to learn? Now, this is definitely not like PoE level because obviously, like the skill trees look fine and so on, right? Like these aren't like too intimidating. But like something like that, I don't know. I might be overreacting right now because I'm going to be a little critical anyway for the sake of being critical, but damn. I sometimes just like, oh, you have to collect this. You have to like go to this, put in the right item. It'll summon this. He'll then drop a currency, which then you have to take to this, but only this. And then like from there, you'll then need to collect another currency if you want the special item. And like, I don't know. It just... My explanations of things are going to be rough. Like I said, I'm sick. It's my excuse. But that's the best I can do for explaining right now. It just does, it doesn't feel great. That's all I'm trying to say. All right, what do we got? What do we got? Where are we going? How do I open the world map? Sanctuary. There it is. Um, gather spirit. Oh, this was our little side quest, maybe? Maybe we'll go over here. Kiova shed. Let's go. Kiova and their shed. What's everyone's favorite uh, pro tip when you get a cold? Anybody have like tried and true methods? I feel like for me, it's just like get all jacked up on DayQuil and uh, go to sleep. <laughs> like, or, or NyQuil, I should say. NyQuil is the one that really just freaking sends you into another dimension. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me your freaking quest. I need the, the uh, experience. Come on, guy. I just love how at this point I'm just treating ARPGs like they're just like arcade games. Like I'm like, I, there's a time and place for the story 
and I'll have it once with Diablo, but like in returning to like side quests and stuff, I'm like, no, no, I got things to do, you know? I'm a busy man. What's over here? What do I have to do? Cheer the training militia. Oh, it's one of the emote quests. Got it. Okay. Oh, let's let's complete this. Wait, I just said I'll handle it. What does that mean? Slash cheer. Wait, is oh, wait, no, 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 no. Isn't there a cheer emote button? Hold on. I had to remap my things. Here it is. Um, hello, empty open chat. I thought there would totally be an emote, right? What's going on here? Cheer, cheer. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Uh, wait, what does that even mean, dude? A sign? Oh, a sign here. I see. I see. I'm learning now, guys. Well, Real time. There it is. Wait, am I? That's it. Sick. Talking about easy experience, am I right? Let's go. Let's go. Did I even receive experience? Oh, yeah, I did. Heck yeah. Uh, let's clean up our inventory. Not throw everything on the ground. Let's go to our stash. Oh, I forgot you can also ride your horse early on, too. Right in the cities? Look at this, them giving us quality of life stuff. I wonder uh, if Last Epoch will ever have mounts, you know? These nighttime meds and sleep? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, anything to keep you sleeping so your body can just do its thing, I feel like is key to overcoming colds. I'm trying to think. I do use, like... My partner's mom, she's got, like, all these, like, super, like, natural remedies things that she swears by. And, um, like, there, I don't even know what half the stuff is, but I just inject myself, basically, with it as much as I can. Because I'm like, honestly, there's no harm, right? Like, I've got this, like, tincture thing that you put under your tongue that, like, is, like, a viral immune stimulator. Let's see, I'm just gonna salvage, I guess, everything. Yeah, why not? Let's do that. Let's freaking do that. And like, I use like wellness pills, multivitamin, vitamin C. I like eat, you know, all the citrus, like all the stuff they tell you to do. And sometimes I feel like it works. Sometimes I feel like I'm just a lost cause and nothing's going to happen for me. Like, like I'm going to be sick forever. But I also blame a little bit of, should we upgrade this? Are we rich? Yeah, we're kind of rich right now. Wait, fully upgraded. Where did it go? Oh no, it's right there. It looked like it almost got rid of it for a second. Um, let's see. We just got this, so let's give it a nice little upgrade. I like how the upgrades are, like, really cheap, uh, in comparison to what we have for gold starting out. Like, that's kind of nice. Magic chest armor, this probably isn't much. Okay, yeah. I guess we're good on that stuff, then. Oh, did we, do we get access to the jeweler now? What level do you need to be? I feel like, um, I was thinking about that last time I was in town, but I forgot how much. Wait, no, we don't want that. Dude, this guy's staff? Look at that. Looks sick. Like a magma staff? I do- Oh, no, I see a lock over the jewel, so I guess we don't have access to that. What is that? Maybe level 20? Maybe even level 15. We're not even there yet. All right, let's do this little side quest here and see what else. We're just going to kind of be wandering around tonight, guys. A little bit of wandering, just getting the routines back for Diablo. Since it's been a little while. When did this game come out? Because, like, whenever it did, it is, like, basically when I last played. And I feel like that was an eternity ago. Uh, okay. I think we just picked up another quest. Let's see. Straight. I just, honestly, I hate not having it overlay on the map. It, it doesn't feel good. It does not feel good at all. Alright, gather cores. Oh, wait, we still have to gather cores for the obelisk. Is that what it's telling us to do? Come on now. Oh, wait, no. They're all over the place. What am I even looking for? What is going on? Hold on, hold on. Let's check our quest situation. Let's see. Drums of the Vault. Oh, we have these, right? Okay, okay, okay. Exorcist Cash. Gather spirit anima from the undead. So I just got to kill people. Now that is something I can get behind. Let's try Meteor, shall we? Has anybody played Sorcerer? Is this like... New gameplay, because I can tell you right now, before Last Epoch, I had no interest in playing any caster in ARPGs, but look at me go now. 
Chose Sorcerer right out of the gate, right in my return here. Let's see, Meteor. Oh, it's like a die. Okay. I don't know how much I love that, but you know what? We got to give it some time. Let's gather some enemies and see uh, if we go back on our word there. Oh, this is the uh, Anima or whatever. Didn't they use Anima in like World of Warcraft and Retail WoW? I feel like that's something I was collecting there last time I played Retail. Oh man, there's a shrine over there. Let's grab that. Bada boom. Conduit shrine. Oh, it's one of these. I remember this. Okay. Dude, these things are sick. It's like just easy mode. That's all it is. There it is. Yeah. Let's freaking go. Although there's no more enemies around. What the heck? Come on, let's pick up that. Yeah, those things are sick. I love that. Especially if you're like actually in trouble. That thing's gonna help you tenfold. All right, what else we got here? We're almost done gathering our anima. Enema of the state. Anybody remember that album? What band is that? That's an oldie but goodie. And not really that old. How dare I say something that was in my childhood was old. I like to joke about it, but not that way. It is dumb. The good old Blink-182. I remember when I bought... Or I shouldn't even say I bought it. It wasn't me buying it at the time because I was that young. Maybe I was in elementary school when Blink-182's Take Off Your Pants and Jacket album came out. And I went into the record store because those things still existed. And um, got the CD. And... I remember the guy at the counter was telling my mom, like, oh, you know, this is like a mature rated album. And my mom never cared about that stuff when I was a kid. Like, I had no restrictions. And uh, she's like, yeah, 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 whatever. And then I'm playing it at home in, like, my living room soon after I got it. And they, if anybody's listened to that album, let's see, I think I'm going to put a little pin there. That seems nice. Um... There's like a bonus track or tracks at the end like that aren't listed on the track list. And they're like super like not okay for like a young child to be listening to. Like, it's like, I, I don't even want to repeat it. It's just, if you know, you know. And I, I, my dad was in the room and was just like, I remember him like just pausing, not saying anything. And then just like looking at me and being like, what the F was that? Like just losing his freaking mind over what I was listening to. I was like, I don't even know what they're saying, dude. This sounds fun to me, though. And like everything about it was not. It was it was just mature rated everything because that's what Blink-182 did, you know? I feel like those moments. Oh, my God. Am I going to die? What's going on here? I should. Pro oh, ooh, wait, hold on. Let's use our meteor. That actually feels so bad. It does not feel right. My god, wait, am I, like, out of my element here? I feel like, uh, I shouldn't be here. We're not doing any damage. Come on, let's take on the challenge. Actually, I don't know if we're gonna be able to take on the challenge. We are not doing so hot right now. Let's drop that meteor on these guys. As it does nothing, yeah, we're out. We're out. We gotta get the hell out of here. Oh, level 45, it's saying. Level 45. That, <laughs> I forgot. You could just end up... Wait, wait, wait. Energies are flowing into this creature. What happened to my freaking horse, dude? Let's go. Let's go. Get out of here. Leave it to me to go like somewhere where I'm like 30 levels behind. The fact that I didn't die is actually I'm patting myself on the back for that one. All right, let's let's uh maybe go into a dungeon or something that we can do. How about that? Let's try this out. Um wait, where are the dungeons? Where do I thought the dungeons would be on the map. Wait, is there a key I can set here? I feel like there probably is, right? Or maybe it's not dungeons. On oh, yeah. These guys. These guys. I just got to zoom in. We got to find some sorcerer ones maybe to do. And also ones that we can actually handle. Sorcerer only for ice shards. Well, we're not using ice shards, so that's kind of a bummer. Incinerate? We might use that. I did try it out. Uh, what level is it? Level 14? We can do that. Uh, let's go back to Kiovashad. Oh, oh, let's not... Let, oh, God. They're coming at us. Oh, I can't even, like, do any, like, weird voices. My... <laughs> my cold is not having that tonight. 
All right, all right, let's <laughs> let's try that again. Kyobushad, where are you? Kyobushad. Let's go. Geez, I'm showing my age with Blink-182. Come on, it's not that old, man. It's like the popular thing, though, for like people in their early 30s and I guess late 20s, too, to be like, oh, Blink-182, like, it's, I'm an old guy now, you know? I just hate how people treat being 30 like it's actually old. That that just bums me out. All right. All right. <laughs> Let's, what was I doing? All right. We're going to a place that we can actually battle in and not get insta-killed. Where was I looking, though? I hate how it doesn't show you unless you zoom in. I'm not accustomed with this map yet, so I'm freaking out. Uh, okay, this is what we wanted to do. Let's pin it. We got to deal with a stupid... Uh, no map overlay. We just got to look in the top corner, which it feels like I'm looking a mile away when I do that. I cannot do that here. Yeah, shut up. Shut up. Shut your... No, I'm not going to be that guy tonight. I, I don't have it. Can't waste my energy on nothingness. Nothing burgers. Isn't that what the kids say? Oh, man, I'm starting to get a little sweaty, guys. Might have to bring this now that I'm on Twitch to the uh, the pools and hot tub section. You know, it's about to get <laughs> wet and wild. Geez, it is old. Come on now. I I like we got to put an end to that stereotype because I actually know people, friends and, and just people I just know who turn 30 and like they shut their life down. And I'm like, dude, 30 is like peak living as far as I'm concerned. Also, by the way, when I logged on to Diablo 4 again and I saw this nonsense i don't even remember if this was here upon release i'm sure it was but is anybody just like they just want to like implode when they see battle passes now because i feel like the only time i feel like this is acceptable and even then it's not technically acceptable is like if i'm playing like call of duty or something so to see like battle passes like this i just in like an rpg it just bums me out because i know people are paying for this I know they're doing it. Meanwhile, they're also probably coinciding playing using battle passes with like crapping on it on the internet because you know that's just how it goes these days. Um, okay, wait, there is something I did want to look at though. I think it's, wait, on my map? Oh, maybe we can't pull it up here because there's like things we can unlock, I think. Hold on, we'll, let me check on that real quick actually. Let's go out here. And then, dude, look how sick I look already. Come on now. Okay, this thing right here. We get, oh, it's the Renown. That's what it's called. Okay, uh, hit W. And then we get like extra stuff with this. I forgot about this. I actually do like this a lot. Like it keeps you motivated to accomplish things. I mean, sure, it's a little like task, like checkboxy, but you know what? Keep me playing, Blizzard. Do something, make it fun. All right. My little nosy's a little bit uh, stuffed, but we are ready to run this dungeon and get our whatever it was. I don't even remember. Let's freaking do this. Um, I'm not going to lie, though, guys. Meteor does not feel great. Anybody else have experience using a uh, meteor on sorcerer? Because like that, Out of mana. I, I need more like I need a new um like movement ability i feel like that's what i'm really lacking right now like I, I i'm really like craving something like that which reminds me maybe we should before we go further because we're not level 15 yet let's take a look at our abilities and see if we have something that is a movement ability to use damage damage wait teleport Transform into lightning, becoming unstoppable and surging to the target location. Why couldn't I be a fireball while doing that? Like, that's a bummer that it's limited. Oh, I guess we get flame shield as a... I guess this is this is what we chose, guys. We're going to be a fire lord in, in multiple games. So this is, this is what it is. I mean, I guess I, I'm open to opening it up to other elements. I just thought it would be cool to... Uh, I've been feeling the fire vibe, I'm not gonna lie. Feels good. Feels real good.
Gotta improve that posture. Okay. Okay. Ooh, we got a little skull over here. I forget what that means. I'm sure it means uh, something pretty epic. Let's toss our hydras down. Okay. Okay. Let's get our flame shield on. Oh, it's this guy. Raccooned. Come on, Racky. Let's go, bud. He's a big boy. He's a big boy, but he's going down. <laughs> this is what happened, but I'm going to make such weird sounds tonight. And you know what? You guys must accept it. You chose to be here. Man, I should have put like a... Uh, I always love doing cheesy things like making a theme out of a stream, even if it's for nothing. I should have like, I don't know, done like a whole I'm sick cold setup. Like put on a, a tissue like outfit or something. I don't know. I don't know. Made a little uh, chandelier out of a tissue box. You know, get the creative juices flowing, you know? I'm low on precious money. <laughs> I just love how everything the characters in Diablo say. It's just like, not I'm just low on mana. I'm, I'm not just low on precious mana. I'm low on precious mana. It's always got to be like, you know. Is it true what they say? An angel no, we're not listening to children talk in creepy environments. We all know children in creepy environments are the worst kind of horror. That and clowns, dude. I can't freaking do clowns. That is officially my actual fear. No clowns for me. One time when I was younger, some of my family members decided to uh, dress up in a clown costume and try and jump through my window as I was a kid, and I will never be the same. Let, like, and I know what you're thinking. That sounds like a terrible family you have, and I'm, I, you're not wrong. You're not wrong there. It is sick what they did to me there. That is why I'll never watch the likes of it. I will never even like even non horror based clowns just freak me out, man. Like if if clowning is your profession, I'm sorry to say you got to go. You got actually I'm not even sorry. You just got to go. I don't know where, but you can't stay here. Ooh, let's get out of that. Oh, let's use meteor because I'm avoiding that, too. Oh, wait, 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 wait. A lot more going on. Hold on. This was unexpected. We're actually not doing that bad. Let me remember to use dash, too. Sick. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. wait. I wonder what's going to be our first real challenge uh, on this character. I don't remember any bosses that I faced in the first, like, 45, 50 levels of Diablo 4 being nearly as challenging as Lagan was in Last Epoch. And like, when I say that was a, a, a challenge, I mean like a really good challenge. I want that kind of experience. Wait, what's going on here? Was I... Take him out, take him out. All right, so we did pretty well. We did pretty well. Honestly, it kind of felt a little too easy, dare I say. Dare I say, a little too easy, Diablo. I thought you were a, a mature game for adults who like challenges, not none of this kiddie nonsense. Let's see, wait, where do we gotta go? Did we clear this already? We don't have to clear anything more. Wait, slay the watchmen? Maybe there's more. I don't wanna abandon this too quickly. Let's drop that meteor down right on my freaking hydras. Not even a good spot for him. These, you played Ball Lightning Sorcerer? Ooh. You like a good charge. I see. How was that? I feel like since you get access to teleport by like going all in on that element, that's uh, already a bonus in my book. It probably would be good for me not to play fire in both games, but you know what? Like, we'll change that later if we if we start to get bored. It's locked. Thank you. Thank you. I saw the lock on the door. Drop that meteor down. That's right. Oh, Hydras. One thing I don't like about minions is how they get ahead of ourselves. Get way too far ahead. 
Hold on. A little tissue break. Haha, -ha, you, you people thought I was going to give you that good viewing of uh, blowing my nose. No, no, no. That, that, that's a premium price. We don't give that away for free. Ah, oh, man. I feel like a new man. Uh, let's see. We got another point here. Let's see. So I'm not loving Meteor, but is there really an alternative? Firewall? Let's give that a try. Why not? We can do it for free right now, right? Or do we just pay for that? I think we paid for it. That's fine. Whatever. Um, and we'll also do the inner flame too. Why not? Because that seemed uh, notable right off the bat. Get away from me, dude. Don't need that sneak attack. Pick a door, any door. Just not the wrong door. All right, let's go. Are you kidding me? I just walked into a friggin' bear trap. Could you imagine if that's how I went out tonight? As my first death on stream? I mean, I could totally believe it. Oh, oh, let's try the wall. Let's try the wall. Hold on, there it is. Freaking like that? Honestly, it just feels better because it's an instant cast and it's out there. Let's get that out. Oh, I got to remember my Hydras. Always, dude, always. The Hydras are key right now to what I'm doing. Oh, we got a Marauder. Marauder. Okay. Oh, we got another boss boy. Let's do it. Let's freaking do it. Let's give him the flames. Let's do that. I lack the needed mana. Shut up. Not with that attitude. You're, if you're a little more positive. Here he is. Grek, Grek Grok. His name is Grek Grok, everybody. Do what you will with that. Okay. Oh, oh. Skill's not ready. Wait, where am I going? Wait, they're coming. They're flanking us, guys. They're flanking us. Hold on. Out of there. Okay. Who's Sue? Now we got Sue coming at us. Whatever. We did it. Gr Gr Grek Grauk, or whatever his freaking name was, was no match for our fire skill. We are truly living by the name of Pyromaniac here. It was honestly way too easy of a title to pick since you get to pick titles in this game, but honestly, I had to do it. It just made too much sense. Atlas, what is going on? Good to see you. Long time no see for real. Welcome in. You've been working your ass off? Good to hear it. Honestly, make that money, Atlas. Glad to hear it. I hope it's not overworking you, though. Nobody needs to be overworked in our lifetime, but unfortunately, way too many people are. Good to see ya. Unfortunately, as I've said to previous people coming in, I am sick. So you're getting uh, the sexy low voiced, which I'm still kind of projecting a little higher anyway. So we're, we're probably half sexy low voiced tonight. So I hope that's okay with you, Atlas. But good to see you. We are on the Diablo 4 kick to kind of check things out, guys. We're just checking things out. We're not abandoning our love in Last Epoch. Which, by the way, guys, I still, I'm still feeling so high on Last Epoch. There are definitely things I'm coming down on in terms of the high. But all in all, I mean, it's been a long time that I've played a game for as long as I've played Last Epoch and felt excited about it every step of the way. I, I mean, maybe it could be the streaming. It could be the content creation. Maybe. But I don't think that's entirely it, to be honest. Because even like playing WoW Classic the other night on stream, I was just kind of like, okay, I don't think it is the streaming that makes me like super hyped on playing games. Like playing games that I've played before or that I'm just a little bit over for right now, it doesn't hit the same, you know? And definitely have a lot of uh, thanks to give for those people over at 11th Hour for giving us a competent ARPG to intertwine into the uh, the rotation of ARPGs these days. And before we know it, guys, next week is the early access for uh, No Rest for the Wicked, which is that ARPG that's 
potentially more of Souls-like in its combat. So we'll have to see how that comes out. I definitely plan on playing it. I have no idea anything about the game. I was definitely going to give it some uh, time to research this weekend and kind of get a feel for what it's going to be. But nonetheless, I love the art style and I'm loving what I'm seeing. And I do love the idea that it's a little bit less hack and slash and potentially more story focused, which I definitely welcome because we definitely have plenty uh, hack and slash arcadey like ARPGs to go around. Okay. All right, what are we doing here? Slay all the enemies, Radiance Field Cemetery. Okay, got it. Where are the enemies, though? I feel like this is so slow-paced, dude. It almost feels like I'm playing WoW Classic again, how slow-paced this feels. What's going on? Are Blizzard games just slow and I don't remember? I, I remember uh, not having such a slow experience, you know? All right, we got a boss boy here. Let's go. Let's freaking do it. Get that firewall up. Like me some of that. I'm out of mana. Dude, why, get more mana. Why are we... Why is mana such a thing? All ready for us. Hugon Taint... Wait, Hugon Taint Spur. His name is Hugon... Taint Spur. Is Blizzard at it again with these names? I mean, for real. There's no hiding that one. They, I know, I'm seeing right through them in their weird ways. Um, also, didn't we do this and we didn't get... What's going on here? I thought we just did this. Am I going crazy? I'm also probably just simply not paying attention, so that's entirely accurate. Let's go back in. I, I thought I completed this freaking nonsense. Although, I, I'm sure I probably reset it by leaving. That That's just typical. Looking good, my guy. Looking good. But yeah, any of you... Going back to what I was saying about my recent clip being criticized by, like, GTA fanboys, which, by the way, I think a lot of them were, like, younger kids, because one some person commented, and I literally had to, like, Google what they meant, because it made no sense. They said... Let me make sure I have this right. It said, like, something along the lines of, like, this is the Elias take of all time. Like, E-L-L-I-E-S-T. Elias. And I was like, what the, what the fuck does that mean? Elias take. I'm like, what? What is that? So I Google it. Nothing's coming up. And I'm like, okay, maybe they, it was a mistype or something. No, no, no. I then discover Elias just meant, like, this is an L take. Like, a, that's, you're taking an L. But they, they made it into... Elliest. And I was like, no. Honestly, I need to get the hell off TikTok, man. This this freaking social media site. They're not like they used to be, let me tell you, kiddos. Elias take of all time kind of just broke me. It was so bad. Okay, what do I have to do? Slay the watchman in here. Follow the astral call for the legacy of the Magi. Wait, what? Isn't the legacy of the Magi the one that Actually, I don't know what's going on. We're just going to complete this again and hope that we get the freaking reward. My gosh. Atlas, are you planning on playing PoE 2 next year? Seeing some clips and it looks amazing? Absolutely. Honestly, it's so funny how this is all working out, by the way. I never imagined I would end up... Also, this guy's just... He's coming at me hard. Where's my construct, guy? Where are you when I need you? There he is. I will be playing PoE before PoE 2. I'll tell you guys that. But what I was going to say is I don't know how it happened. I started covering Last Epoch in Early Access before release just because it felt like a good start to my YouTube channel and all that. But now it's kind of turned into like diving into more ARPGs, which I've never really had a favorite genre. I've just liked RPGs in general. And here I am, and I feel like we're just doing a lot of ARPGs, and honestly, I'm totally okay with it. I'm still, like, forming what I want, the future of what I become on the YouTube channel and so on. And uh, if it's ARPGs, honestly, as long as I'm having fun, then so be it. So 
PoE is going to be probably next on the list of trying other ARPGs out outside of Last Epoch for right now. I don't want to like abandon games though. I don't want to like dip into some and then dip out too quickly. So I don't know when we'll start PoE, but that'll be a big thing that I'll I'll keep you guys in the loop on on Discord and on YouTube. Uh, just to give you guys an update of when we'll probably start diving into it. Just because that one we have to, right? Like, I mean, I've played it so briefly in my life. And it would be nice to deep dive some skill trees a little more in that game, to be honest. Um, there's just so much going on that... I, I just feel like it would be a disservice not to give it a try. So, I imagine lots of PoE in the future. And we'll see with the Diablo how long this lasts. I want to give it a fair shot, though. It definitely is going to continue on into Season 4 for right now, only because I hear a lot of good stuff is coming in Season 4. I have to, like, take a... or give myself an update on what's coming in Season 4 as well, though. I don't remember all the fine details, but I'm taking people's word for it, you know? Ooh, baby. All right, hold on. Hold on. We, we got to get the air going. Let's see, we got the, let's see, set it for 68, because that's, that's where I'm at right now. It feels like 87 in here. All right, uh, we do have a skill point. Let's add that. We'll do more of this. Inner flames. Let's go. Freaking crazy. Man, when I, when, since I've been sick the last couple days, I've just been like watching stuff versus um, playing games as much, because I'm, I'm weird like that. I don't know if you guys have this feeling where like, if you feel tired or lacking energy, then you don't even want to play video games, even though that's not exactly a strenuous activity. It's like more of a mental thing. Let's jump out of that. These guys are kind of hitting me hard. And so I've been watching stuff and I started watching X-Men 97, the reboot on the original X-Men cartoon from 97. And honestly, I'm three episodes out of the five in and not gonna lie, guys, it's kind of sick. So if you're into that stuff, I highly, highly recommend it. Let's see, we gotta slay one more Watchmen. Let's go find him. It is actually really good. It's on Disney Plus, and I think you should probably go watch it. Right after this stream, even. Don't waste any time. Atlas, did they mean the illest? Honestly, that was a part of my thought process. At first, I thought illest. And in that case, that would mean it was a great take, potentially. But I didn't respond to them because honestly, I, I didn't want to open up a can of worms. I usually don't respond to anything that is like potentially uh, negative that's opening that door for uh, trolls. But honestly, I should ask because I got to know now. I've already used way too much oxygen and thought time on wondering what it means. Okay, we gotta find that. Oh, a door in here, sick, sick. All right, we gotta figure out how to do this without, um... oh God, oh God, oh God. This is not where I wanna be. Hold on, blow him up. Oh wait, wretched scorcher. Oh God, oh God, we're caught in the in-between. Oh no, there's a door there blocking him, sick. Let's get that wall down and go buy it. Oh, I forgot my construct kind of like tanks things. Super helpful. Take those guys down. Does he even lose health? Honestly, it looks like he didn't even lose health. But yeah, it's so funny. That was my first clip that I posted in regards to like a type of clip where I'm just kind of like making a little ranty statement. And, uh,. Lo and behold, that's all it takes is something super minor to get people all like bent out of shape. Good reminder for next time I want to like post something that is either sarcastic or like intentionally not supposed to be serious because inevitably people are going to take it seriously and get so hurt by it. Like I'm not even that person. I don't even want to like do fiery things, but I can be sarcastic or I can just like lean into something because it's harmless but funny but people like like what i mean is like i would never say anything that's like discriminative or like 
anything that harms people like that like that's terrible but like when it comes to like oh i like a game or like i like to play a game in a way that you don't like to play and now you're hurt by it i'm like honestly just chill out man there's like one life to live and all that jazz that is not how you want to live it but then again TikTok. am i right TikTok is a is a special place Greg Rock. Oh, this is the guy from last time. Greg Rock. I gotta write that name down. What a great name. Drop in a helm. Wait, get that wall down. Get that wall down. Dive. Honestly, every time I place the wall, I'm like, I feel like nobody's even walking into it. Oh yeah, we got Sow down. Sick. Okay, so we got the Watchman's key. Use the Watchman's key to open the Watchman's gate. Okay, that's what we did wrong, I think. There's the Watchman's Gate, so we gotta go there. My gosh. That's what we forgot to do last time. We just left. Silly me. Atlas, nowadays the youngsters are so emotional. I mean, you're not wrong. And, like, here's the thing. I would prefer a world where people are not, like, robotic and not wanting to tap into emotions. But, like, when it's, like, the bad version of emotions, like, getting all hurt by over like buy things that are like not personal at all like you got to draw the line somewhere and that's definitely the line for sure it's just like not being able to make jokes like i think we all know where the line is when it comes to like joking around and if you don't then like i just suggest you learn where that line is but my gosh like if it's just like oh if you play if you stop at red lights in grand theft auto then you're playing the game wrong which honestly i still stand by that if you want to role play by all means but like how many people have told you like this is how i play the game and honestly i'll never play in the way where you take rocket launchers to random people in cars obviously that's way more fun my fondest memories of playing grand theft auto wasn't stopping at stop signs it was ghost riding people down, like off cliffs in cars like Nobody plays the game and has a genuinely great experience. And maybe they do, but I, I still stand by my way. Just because anecdotally, I've heard way more people enjoy it that way. Like, come on now. If we take a universal poll of gamers everywhere that have played the game, we know what the uh, popular response would be. Also, man, we got a lot going on in here. Hold on, hold on, get me out of that. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Lay the wall down, right? Heal up a little. Dude, fireball is kind of hitting pretty hard right now. Kind of freaking hard. There we go. There we go. Guys, am I just like so good at this game? Like, holy. I feel like I was dying more in Last Epoch early on than I am in here. Is Diablo 4 an easy game, guys? For just super casuals? Can you believe it? Diablo 4 for casuals. I never thought I'd see the day. You guys can go ahead and clip that one while you're at it, too. Bring it on, TikTok fam. I'm, I'm coming. The freight train is coming. <laughs> is our meanwhile GTA 5 is full of... MF stopping at red lights. Well, yeah. Well, here's the thing. After the fact, after I posted that and started thinking about it more, I forgot that GTA 5 roleplay is like a whole thing. And I was like, oh, God. Oh, God. I did not mean like, oh, no. Like, I just knew that all this now makes sense, you know? Like, and don't get me wrong. I see the appeal. I love roleplaying and fantasy RPG stuff. But like playing cops and robbers... I'm not going to criticize it directly, but it's just I'd rather pretend to be like a warrior in a LARP event and hit people with foam axes, you know, just seems like a cooler thing to do. I don't know. Who's to say? All right, what do we got here? Can we finally get our freaking sorcerer ability? Honestly, I should just speed run it since I'm so good. And since this game is so easy. Okay. One more door, maybe? There it is. 
Wait, come on. Where? I feel like the Hydras take a while to spawn. Ooh, Revenant. Who's this guy? Oh, he's a nobody. He's a nobody. That's fine. Okay. Drop that down. Drop a firewall. Now we got him. My gosh, dude. Wretched Vol Codlack? Got it. Is that what they call werewolves in whatever language they na natively speak here? Vodka lack? Protection shrine. I'll take me one of those. Let's freaking go. Storm. Uh, storm. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I'm not even like this type of crude humor, but I thought that said Storm Wang and not Warg. That's, that's where I'm at, guys. I'm sick. Leave me alone. Meanwhile, like, you got Storm Wargs, and then you just get Prowler. That guy lost the freaking bet. Hey, sorry, do you hardly stop at them in IRL? <laughs> Come on, now. No, no, no. We're... I'd like to think my... My chat is full of really well... Level-headed, kind people who know the law. You know? Is that the case, guys? Or, or is everyone following Izard here? Ride or die, baby. <laughs> Man, honestly, after driving out of the city recently, I don't really drive much anymore. There's some psychopaths on the road. Izard, were you on the road with me? Is that is that why I'm having those feelings? I feel like I almost got hit like six times. And I'm, by the way, I say that and I've driven a lot in my life. I've driven across the United States many times. I'm always the driver for things back when I did drive. But people nowadays are freaking me out, dude. Truly chaos out there. Like, people say this New York City subway is not safe. No, no, no. Get in a car on an interstate and you tell me what's safer. I will gladly take a crazy guy chasing after me than someone going 120 and, like, almost sideswiping me. Any day of the freaking week, dude. Cool. Man, this is kind of a long dungeon. I mean, I'm also probably going so slow, but it, I feel like the game is making me slow. It's obviously the game's fault. Like, I should be going way quicker than this, right? <laughs> Deez, hang out with your way. Yeah, <laughs> come on. No, no, no. We're not, we're not, uh, Asmund Goldstream, guys. Don't, don't mistake me. I know we, we, uh, we probably look alike. I couldn't even say that with a straight face. There's no big dick energy in this stream, let me tell you. If you hear me say big dick, it's definitely just a mockery. <laughs> I cannot say that and actually, uh, respect myself. But then I always think of things that are like super cheesy and in return, it's like, we got to think of something that's cool, but not cringy, like big dick en energy. More like, like cringy would be like big respect energy. It's like almost like a kid's song. No, we got we to gotta think of something good. Okay, light, lights war room. Oh God, hold on. I wanted to take a sip of tea. My freaking voice is going out. Come on. Hold on. This guy doesn't understand freaking boundaries and respect. I'm, not ready I'm handicapped on my vocal abilities right now due to viruses annihilating my sinuses. Come on. Where did he go? Wait, wait, what the? No. No. I don't even know what button I misclicked there, but it did not seem... Like a good thing. The den mother. Come on, mommy. Come on, come on. Honestly, like, what is that? You just disappear for a few seconds and nothing happens. Like, oh, that was fun. That was sick. Real, real challenging, guys. I told you, Diablo 4, casual game, guys. Hear me now. Oh God, oh God, <laughs> hold on. Hear me in a minute. Okay, hear me now while he's gone doing whatever he's doing. She, I mean, den mother. 
Come on. Come after me. Do your worst. It's pathetic. Yeah, go through my fire. Through the fire and flames, everybody. We're going back to playing some guitar, hero. There it is. There it is. Guys, I'm not even sweating. And I'm sick, and I usually just naturally sweat when I'm sick, like I said. That's how easy this freaking game is. Also, what happened? We are actually in uh, inventory trouble. Although, I think we got our freaking sorcerer thing, by the way. Which is kind of sick. Hold on, let's get out of here. Let's go back to Kyovashen and deal with that. Also, where do we find those things that we unlock in the dungeons? I forget. Alice, speaking of Vazmon, what's wrong with his eyebrows? They are leading an own life. That's the thing, man. I don't I don't know, man. Honestly, out of all the things Asmon is, I feel like the most impressive thing about him is his ability to use that as like a a uh an act almost like his eyebrows like being able to control them like that i mean it's probably natural he probably doesn't even mean to do it but it's become a thing and like literally it makes him money in a way passively it's kind of like hilarious when you think of that stuff man it's been so long since i like i had a brief period where i used to watch asmund and then it just got a little out of hand for me in the sense of like, I don't know, like prior to streaming, I was more of a viewer and I actually preferred viewing smaller streamers only because I just feel like it was more interactive and like less showy. Like some of those giant streamers, it's like such a production, which I think is it's a really great thing. I think it offers a great value of entertainment, but that's just not the entertainment I'm looking for, particularly. All right, Determined Auger. This is nine willpower. Also, which stat should we stack, I guess? Uh, what's willpower? Resource regeneration. We do need that. Oh, yeah. What is overpower, guys? How do I look at that? I see you can, like, scroll over it. Is there, like, a way for me to get there? Overpower, overpower, chance. Okay. Okay. When you cast a skill, it has a chance to overpower all of the damage it deals. Deals bonus damage based on your current life up to 50%. Okay. Okay. I I have an idea then. Um, ooh, a rare helm. Plus one rank Hydra. Okay. Let's equip that. Dude, We, I'm telling you, in my experience from back before the seasons, this itemization already is way better. Like, by a long shot. Got an amulet here. We'll add that. Okay, let's see. Anything else? It looks like we got a lot to work with here. Hold on. Um, let's see. Is this wand better? Damage to close enemies? Well, we're kind of close to a lot of enemies. Plus five all stats on this dagger, though, which is kind of sick. Not going to lie. Let's see. I feel like we could use to do more damage, though. Ooh, this, this is kind of nice if we want to trade out... Wait a second. No, no, we want to we want to stay with what we're using, I think. For now. Okay. Oh, we'll actually equip this, I guess. That's kind of an upgrade. Armor-wise. Oh man, I feel like my brain is working in like 2 miles per hour right now. Ugh. Ugh. I hate this feeling. I hate when I'm not like honestly being sick is like one of my least favorite things in life. It makes you so grateful for when you're actually healthy and it makes you realize like when you're being lazy while healthy you are a piece of crap dude like there's no excuse right like it's the first thing i think about is like man if i was healthy i'd do so much and then you get healthy and you do so little i like i am so aware of that wait a second here uh fire damage lightning damage maximum life I think we will swap that out. Sick. Another upgrade there. Ooh, this wand. Oh, plus eight to all stats. Oh my god. Good thing I saw that. Okay, we're we're in good shape now. Let's uh get rid of these. Get rid of that. And can we do a little bit of upgrading? Atlas creeping 
it, oh, I, I was like, what is I, IYS? Like, are, are we going back to the kid slang? It's creeping me out. It's crazy. Yeah, his, his eyebrows, dude. Nuts. Um, man, if only I think I think the first time someone brought that up on stream, I tried doing it and I, I like made a fool of myself. Oh, gosh. Let's see. Good, good, good. Let's see. Tonight's a Friday night, meaning my stream shouldn't be cursed. So, like, everybody cross their fingers right now and knock on wood. Because uh, when we streamed on Monday, which is not typical of me, uh, we had a little hiccup in the stream. And that only happens on nights I don't typically stream. So I know something's up. Uh, wait, do we have to repair this? What's going on? Wait, where is uh, repairability? God, it's so crazy. All the time I ever played Diablo, now I just feel like a complete amateur again. All right, we're upgrading this. 2,500. Pocket chains, man. Pocket change. Let me upgrade everything so I can be a literal god. Even though I probably shouldn't even do this considering... Uh... Oh, I'm so used to last epoch holding onto your equipment. I'm trying to like put it back. Let's see, can't do anything there. That's fine. Anything like, that's the quality of life we need to get back into that game. Or not back, just in general in that game. Like, when you put your stuff in the forging slots, like, there's no reason why it should stay there. Okay, I still can't unlock the jeweler. Are you freaking kidding me? Um, let's find where the, um... Who are they called? The, the potion person is. Where is that person? Because I think you can upgrade your potion somewhere. Is it this person? The Father's Light. Heal you. Not that person, I guess. Maybe the alchemist. Let's check them out. Yep, this is it. Uh, oh, level 20. Okay, got it. I do not have the We're not there yet, I guess. Ooh, elixirs. I could use an elixir myself right now. Uh, poison resist. Okay, we got nothing. We got nothing, guys. All right, what should we do now? Where should we go? Um... Maybe we should just do some of these random uh, quests right here. Why not? Let's hop into there. Sick. Alice, there's a compare button. Oh, in terms of the inventory? Wait, hold on. Oh, wait, I have nothing to compare to now, I guess. But yeah, I, I thought there was. But in terms of like, is there an easy way? Like if you're looking at... See, like, here on screen, it shows, like, overpowers bold and underlined. Like, can I, like, alt-click or something so I could get over to it and hover it? Because I feel like I'm missing something in that department, but I don't know. All right, hold on. I'm going to refresh my tea with some more hot water, so I'll be back in literally, like, two seconds. Be right back. All right, two seconds is up, right? That was just two seconds. Also, my light's not on behind me, guys. Wait, way to have my back here, guys. See that? We got the freaking light. That's how you know. That's how you know you got to watch the stream. You cannot be a real streamer unless you got the light in back. Everybody knows that. Amateur stuff. Come on now. At least this time, uh, unless you guys are not pointing it out. Nope, nope. Our game audio is here. I, I'm never going to, like, let that disappear in my memory. The fact that we played Last Epoch on one stream and... <laughs> excuse me. Had no game audio. I blame Deez for all of that, by the way. Deez was there. Deez failed to mention... Oh, God, my voice is cracking. That's where we're at. Uh, oh, wait. This is the thing that we have to do? Here we go. Here we go. Get in there. Oh, God. Oh, God. Stand in that. Stand in that. Wait. Wait, no, that's not anything? What's going on? I'm confused as to what is going on here. Hold on. Toss that in there. I just feel like I don't want to stand in the red, right? That's like gaming 101. 
Whatever, well, let's stand in it. What's the worst that can happen? Shocking Ice Clan Impaler. What a stupid, silly name. If only he knew the way of fire. Did uh, anybody, now that it's... I think it actually came out yesterday, but now that it's Friday, anybody watch... Oh, wait. Oh, God. Where is everybody? Anybody start watching the new Fallout show? Or anybody fans of Fallout, even? I feel like you don't even have to be a fan to watch the show and still enjoy it, but... I have yet to watch it. I'm probably going to watch it tonight after stream. It looks real good. And even if it sucks, like, story-wise, honestly, will probably just look really good. It looks like it has a big budget. And it's crazy, too, because they're also timing it with the fact that the new gen update for Fallout 4 is getting released in a few weeks. And, like... I'm like, honestly, are we just, like, returning to Fallout again? Like, is this becoming a thing? It's kind of sick. That, like, Fallout is one of those games that really brings me back. Uh, wait. Oh, we must have equipment that's giving us points here. That's probably why. Let's see. Devouring Blaze, you deal 7% increased critical strike damage against burning enemies. Um, your pyromancy skills have up to a 5% chance to immobilize enemies for two seconds. That's kind of sick. We'll keep working our way through that, I guess. Let's see, anything good that dropped? Ooh, plus one rank chain lightning. Doesn't really help us now. Oh no, we want the plus three stats. For sure. Oh, it it was quiet? Wait, what were you saying it was quiet to? Um, oh, oh, what I was criticizing you for, Deez. That's what you were saying. Um, the Fallout show, I believe, is on Amazon. So you're going to need an Amazon Prime membership for that one. Luckily, I literally live off of Amazon basically at this point. I know, I know. I've met people that are like, Amazon is the devil. But I'm like, literally, I live in a place where I don't have access to big box stores. So guess what? Amazon is everything to me. Toilet paper? Amazon, baby. Like, literally any toiletry or any... Honestly, even groceries, you get groceries delivered on Amazon in New York so easy. Amazon is life, guys. All hail the trillion dollar mega corpo of Amazon. It is here to stay. There's going to be an Amazon on the moon one day when we're all living there. You just got to do what you got to do, man. You just got to do what you got to do. Atlas, is Kevin Hart playing in it? Uh, honestly, I hope not, but I honestly, I I wouldn't be surprised. Um, isn't Kevin Hart in the new Borderlands movie that's coming out? Um, I think I just saw that recently, and I'm like, oh god, of course he is. Honestly, the best part about the new Borders Borderlands movie is the fact that Claptrap, um, for those who are familiar with the game The Robot, is voice acted by Jack Black. And I don't know if I've ever mentioned this on the channel, but Jack Black is truly everything I ever want to be in a human. I love Jack Black. Him, another actor I really love is Keanu Reeves. Two very different people I know. But my God, Jack Black is the man. Anybody else just, if, if you hate Jack Black, don't even, don't even say it. That's all I'm going to say. You don't even want to know what I'll freaking do. I'll lose it. Before I lost consciousness, was go over the cliff. I need to return to Kuyovashad and request a night escort. Uh, am I your escort now? Is that is that what you're telling me? Oh wait, no. That this was just like the little side quest. Uh, oh, we should go here so we can collect this. Sick. Let's do that. I forgot. I'm getting so distracted. We were just doing a little side quest. Let's see. So we started the stream at level ten. It's been an hour forty two minutes of me. Doing my usual less than optimal run through, and we're at level 17. So that's feels pretty good. We'll see how it goes after level 20. How did this happen? How, how did this happen? I feel like everyone in the world of Sanctuary is like, how did this happen? And it's like, uh, you're living in hell, guys. Uh, I thought you'd figure this out by now. Apparently not. Okay, what do we got here? 
Uh, we'll sell that, I guess. We'll just sell some stuff, get some easy money. A Puggio. A Puggio. I'm Italian, so uh, I, I know my way around Italian things. For example, like pizza and... And... Pizza... And, uh... Mario... All those very Italian things. Universally Italian. Uh, let's see. Alright, let's do some more... Maybe we'll... Let's continue on with... Wait, what's this? Sorcerer Quest? Ooh, maybe we should do this. Let's try that instead. I was gonna tell us... I was gonna tell us, as if I'm also talking to myself. Um... I was going to do some of the season quests, but let's do some class quests. I feel like that should be quite beneficial. Deez, that's what I'm talking about. School of Rock. Don't even get me started, guys. School of Rock. Top five. Top five movies of all time. You want to fight me on that? By all means. Let's get the fist of cuffs going. Wait, how do I get off this thing? All right, we're good. School of Rock, literally peak cinema. That's all I'm going to say. Like, think about it, though. No other person other than Jack Black could have played that character and had it be a good movie. If it was anyone else, the movie would have been absolute trash. It would have been cringy. It would have been weird. It would have been less than... It would have been exclusively a kid's movie. But even into adulthood, that movie freaking holds up. It is everything. All right, follow the astral call. Wait, I thought we that's what we were doing, man. Hold on. Oh, I'm just not paying attention. All right, we got to go all the way down here. Are you kidding me? All right, let's travel back here. Ain't got time to run around. <laughs> Atlas Masterpiece? Ooh, guys, I thought I liked you guys already. If you guys like Jack Black and you love School of Rock, it's like that that Step Brothers moment. Do we just become friends? Yup. This is happening. It's all coming together, guys. I knew I knew you guys were special. I mean, I, I grew up on movies like that, so obviously I'm like a little bit biased. But I feel like, like I said, you could be a kid and love it, an adult and love it. I love those movies. All right, let's uh, put a little point on here. A little pin. Is that a person or an NPC? Who is that? All right, let's let's uh, horse race all the way to it. Barbie horse adventure. Minus the pink horse. Man, I, I'm trying to think of like other movies now. I'm actually not a big movie watcher, but like the movies I do watch and enjoy, I'm like all in on. Um, let's see. Recently, I just watched Asteroid City, the new Wes Anderson film, or one of the new ones, I think. Um, and that one was actually really good only because, or not only because, but it had a lot of like big name actors that did a really good job in it. Um, so I was really impressed with that. Like it had like Steve Carell and Scarlett Johansson. Um, and like Steve Carell, for example, was the Steve Carell comedy we all know and love, but with like the hint of Wes Anderson as well. So it was like super cool. Uh, let's see. Find the weapon of a local legend. Sounds like uh, the weapon that's in my pocket. Am I right? Dude, Magladena is a, honestly a sick name, by the way. All right. Follow the astral call. I'm in the area. Let's find it. Let's see. Is there any way I can look at? I feel something. A voice on the astral wind calling out dimly somewhere in the mountains. Is this call meant for me? I should investigate. I don't know why I read that so robotically, but it... Oh, here it is. Here it is. Here's here's the astral call. I mean, it would probably help if I was, like, paying attention to what he's saying, but you know what? Broken crate. Oh, maybe this chest? <laughs> help! <laughs> uh, okay. I found a petal of blood. You see? You see how the petal... Sick. All right, let's go. We're, we're getting even closer. Uh, We're going all the way here, huh? Okay. 
Well, what about this? Return the Maros. Well, I guess we got to go here first. Right? Wait, is that... Oh, no, it's down here. Hold on, hold on. Whole different area. Okay, we're heading here. Sick. Okay, we could walk there, too. Nice. All right, let's freaking go. Oh, man. I was just thinking when I went to the, like, be right back screen, uh, when I, every time I leave my computer, I honestly don't know why I do that for you guys. Like, I'm not, like, I don't know. Like, there's no, like, there's nothing I need to hide when I do that. It just feels like, you know professional I, I don't even know that sounds ridiculous to say but i was like honestly like it kind of leaves some mystery am i right like you guys don't know what i look like down below like you, i could i could be a freaking centaur as far as you guys know you have no idea i could have like robotic legs and i'm like honestly we're gonna keep that up you don't even freaking know the mystery lives on all because I decided that it was a legitimate, cool thing to do by putting up a B right back screen. I need time to prepare that. I always just thought it was weird, you know, like when you, like, go onto a streamer's stream and you see like the empty chair and you're like, uh, is this is this the thing? Is this like their their shtick? It's like, oh no, they're just not there. Come on. Where was my construct going? Why was he so far away? Ooh, what's this? It's the astral call. Ooh, what's... Th wait, wait a second. Do we have to fight this guy? Slay the channeler. Oh, oh, he's right here. Hold on. There it is. Oh, now we get to face him, too. What a great reward for helping him out. Are you kidding me? Hold on. Take these guys out. Okay. Get him down, get him. Oh, he's immune again? Oh, this is one of those annoying battles where you gotta keep, like, killing these guys to get damage in on him. Okay. Stay away. Oh, and there he's summoning more, too? What the hell is this, dude? Dude, I'm doing no damage with my, like, fire bolt or whatever it is. Absolutely none. Hold on. Where's the other guy that's channeling him? still an easy game though it's just annoying now that's very fitting a blizzard i'd say let's make an easy game that's annoying and full of tasks blizzard 2024 come on come on i feel like i'm just like unfairly an echo chamber for things on blizzard because it's fun to say and it's such a shame too because like I actually really do love Blizzard in terms of like what they were and what they became. At least in terms of the games of what they became, not not the other stuff. Wait, come on. I feel like there's always somebody up making him immune. I mean, I'm probably just too slow with the damage I'm doing, but still. Also, these guys need to get out of my freaking face, dude. Hold on. We gotta get rid of all these ads. Dude, these race actually hurt. Oh my god, dude. Get me out of here. Okay, okay. Can he finally die? There it is. There it is. Where were you before, Dr. Vault 4? And why are you opening my freaking chest, dude? What did you do to help this situation? Because honestly, you kind of just sat back and watched me struggle. I do not appreciate that. Is this one of you? Are any of you right now Dr. Vault 4? I got a word to have with you. Uh, more, di more, more Darin. Okay. Please forgive the mental intrusion. Oh my gosh. I, could only I am not prepared to keep talking like I usually do on stream. Alice, you thought I wasn't wearing any pants? D's, take a pic, send. No, no, no. That is breaking code. D's. Alice, and that you didn't want to get banned. <laughs> Honestly, I feel weird about streaming in, like, pajamas or something. I'm like, I'm not going to broadcast myself out to the world in my private, you know, getup. That's for private eyes only. That's got to be earned. And we don't do that to strangers on the internet. No offense, my great chatters. But you don't get the 
the the pajamas, the birthday suit, you know, this and that. I don't know, whatever other suits you guys can think of. Maybe I should just wear a suit on stream and really call it a professional stream. Ooh, doing a number on that that speaking voice tonight, guys. You got to pay for the good stuff. That's what I'm saying. It doesn't come free. It comes at the cost of my my trust. You know, and we don't do that. As as much as I appreciate you guys, we don't we aren't on a birthday suit level of interaction here. You know what I mean? As much as Twitch, now that we're streaming on Twitch, allows it, for the most part. We're not there quite yet. No, but going back to what I was saying, like, I don't even wear, like, gym shorts most of, most of the time. Like, I just feel like I treat streaming like I'm, like, actually, like, hanging out with people. And I'm like, well, would I show up in, like, pajamas? It's like, no, I wouldn't. I would show up wearing pants like a normal person, you know? It only seems proper, you know? Meanwhile, I, you know, I, I see what's on the platforms and I'm like, dude, I don't know how people like show themselves on camera without some level of decency, you know? Ooh, baby. I don't know if we're going to be able to do three hours tonight, guys. Or over three hours as I usually do. We are, we're going to go until my voice is gone. How about that? I can uh, give you guys signals with my eyes, you know, speak with them. I'm not exactly that performative, but we'll try. Swimsuit Atlas. I honestly don't even know if I own a swimsuit. Is that crazy? As I said, I'm not even, or I'm not exactly an outdoorsy person. So, uh. I usually have a farmer's tan. What's going on here? Did they just die? Are you kidding? There it is. There it is. I knew that would happen tonight because I'm going to be muting so much more. Oh my gosh. What have I been talking about? Probably nothing worth revisiting. <laughs> oh gosh. Thank you for that Atlas, by the way. That's how it's done, these. By the way, you know, when things are muted, that's, that's how you uh, let people know, you know? You don't leave anybody hanging. No, I think I was just talking about how I always have a farmer stand and never have a bathing suit to do things outside. But this year is going to be different, everybody. You're going to see Kintsugi in the in nature, whatever that means. I, I still have yet to figure out what that means.
Okay. All right, so what are we thinking? What are we thinking here? Diablo 4, Diablo 4. Is this a better experience than Last Epoch so far? Potentially. I'm also not exactly going to judge it wholeheartedly because we haven't... Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. I mean, first and foremost, step one, or bullet point one, Diablo 4, easy game for casuals. So I don't appreciate that at all. And I'm a casual, so that's saying something. Um... It also feels super slow. I don't know how I feel about that. Everything feels... Whoa, wait, wait, wait. See, this is what I mean. Easy game. Why are they giving us so much free money, dude? Is this what the people wanted? What the heck? It's like I don't even have to do anything. I got these Hydras. They do all the damage for me. Um, But the ambiance, guys. <laughs> Blizzard's got the ambiance. It sounds so sick. I guess that's that's a great thing. No, but in all seriousness, I do want to do a little bit more of an objective comparison between uh, if I do give Diablo 4 more time and do more of a uh, legit comparison of the games and where they stand, especially now that Last Epoch's obviously out of the initial release and Diablo 4, maybe I'll wait for the season four to give it a fair shot for comparison's sake. Atlas, you tried the lip read, but your lips move like crazy. Oh, man. See, that's... Listen, you want to spy on me? No, no, no. We move like lightning around here. I might be a fiery boy, but that's just in passion. I don't know. I was going to go into a whole tangent on, like, lightning and speed. I don't think I have it in me tonight. Come on. Literally, I do no damage without the freaking Hydras. I do nothing. Okay, what's this mechanical box? Let's try it out. Oh, it's on our back. Okay. Sick. Now where? Uh, return the mechanical box to the pedestal. Okay. Let's see where that is. Oh, there's two of them. I see. All right, let's go. Let's freaking go. These, you didn't notice? Come on. I can't tell if that's a shot, but honestly, if it is, well done. Well done. See, I, I'll... I'll break your guys' balls, but I'll give credit where credit's due. It's a give and take, guys. It is a give and take around here. This is not a one-sided thing. What's going on? Literally, is, are we just handling stuff on our own construct? Well done. Well done. All right, let's see where this other mechanical box is. Uh, Oh, my God, dude. I feel like I just clicked seven buttons at once there. Uh, It must be over here, right? Let's go over there. Lost Archives. I wonder what we're getting out of this uh, dungeon. Oh, oh, I just, I did not mean to do that. Hold on. Okay. Let's find our little toy box and get it to the pedestal. I'm not ready yet. But what are we thinking, guys? So right now, I was saying earlier this week on Monday when I was healthy and feeling like a uh, chipper human being, rest in peace to that person, um, I'm actually debating adding Monday to the stream schedule so we can rock three days a week, mainly because I feel like it would help me out in getting more game time in on games I'm playing, because if I'm not playing games on stream, I do play them off stream, but I get so caught up in ideas for writing scripts and doing stuff, which I've been severely lacking on. I'm putting out content, but, you know, real life happens. And uh, if we continue on with a heavier stream schedule, should we continue further with more in-depth and more classes on Last Epoch? Should we roll with more Last Epoch exclusively? Or do we like checking out new games like Dragon's Dogma, which I've been playing off stream a little bit too, and that's been an absolute treat. And here we are also trying other ARPGs. I just feel like for me personally, mixing it up feels good to not do the same thing every night. So I'm thinking with the added stream, it can help in allowing us to uh, kind of explore other things when we want, but maybe have a dedicated day or two that is for Last Epoch. 
I mean, I, I never imagined myself doing like exclusively one game and that's not the case here, but I just feel like, I don't know guys, it's, it's fun. And because it's the start of the game, there's so much potential in my eyes that I'm like, you know, until I get bored, until I get bored. Like that's what I keep telling myself. The only thing with Last Epoch is I don't know like if I'm going to have it in me to want to run through all the characters and then play Endgame on that grind as where it stands now. But then again, a new or the first season should start sooner than later. So maybe it'll catch up with us and that won't be an issue at all. So I don't know. Oh, we got Spirit Caller Frost. We got Killer Frost here. Okay. Easy mode, easy mode, I see. Honestly, I forgot. There's like the world tier too where you can make things harder. I feel like I should have done that. Or is that like super hard? Does anyone have experience playing that difficulty? Because I know it's like high risk, high reward. All right, let's pop that. Dude, I just keep running in the mana trouble. It feels bad. It feels real bad. Okay. Pop that down. Like, if I'm not using Fireball, look at that. These freaking bolts, dude. Let's add a little Firewall. Why not? Add that, too. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What is that? What, what is that, dude? Those are, like... No, ready those bodies were, like, shaking all the way to bursting. Honestly, kind of cool. Kind of cool. Okay. All right. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, why? This is what I was looking for. Hold on. Wait, do we have to equip these or do we just have them? I think we just have them. That's kind of sick. I thought we had to equip these for some reason. Nice, dude. Wait, damaging an elite enemy grants you a barrier absorbing up to 210 damage. Is that like ward? I forget. If we can stack that, that would be sick. Uh, let's see. We got to go over here. So let's hop out of here. Nevesk. Atlas, multiple games means diverse viewers. Indeed, it does. Especially if they're not in the same genre, which is why I'm like... I mean, like I said, I'm still exploring. There is no, like, right or wrong for me right now. But, uh... That's why I ask you guys the questions, too. I'm curious of the feedback. I don't want to be in my own head all the time. It's a crazy place in there, by the way. Crazy place. Ooh, baby. Gotta get that tissue going. All right, all right. Get your cameras out. Ready for this? I know that's the content you sickos wanted to see. So you're welcome. You're welcome for that showing. Don't get used to it. Gonna have to start charging by the blow. <laughs> Deez, I, if you gave me one guess of who would say nice to that, well, Deez, you would have been my guess. Wait, what are we doing here? Recover the Forgotten Codex. All right, let's do it. I will say, just like what I said in my last Epoch experience, my only experience in Diablo, going back to Diablo 2 and Diablo 3, is playing Barbarian. So, yeah, just being in the world of Diablo in Sanctuary as a caster is also yet again another wildly new experience for me. Oh, uh, wait. Where do I have to go? I was just here. What do you mean? This is why. This is why. I... I... I don't know what happened, guys. I don't know what happened. I guess I'm just freaking... I don't know. I don't know. My mind's not working. There's, there's mucus up there, I think. There's mucus everywhere. Oh, man. I honestly just... I. Oh, man. My biggest fear, by the way, and I'm going to point this out now. I Every time I get sick, you know when you blow your nose a lot? One of my biggest fears is, like, getting a bloody nose. Because I feel like, you know, like... it. If you blow your nose a lot, like, that can happen. And I'm like, that is my worst fear, is getting a bloody nose on stream. I'm like, there's no way 
there's literally like two to give you guys an uh, an example of how much I fear this. There's two pieces of tissue on my desk at all times because I'm like one of these days, dude, it's going to start flowing and like, I don't know what I'm going to do. And that's what the tissues are for. My fear will be somewhat mended in a way. Like, I just, has, has anybody ever watched a streamer get, like, a bloody nose or something weird like that on stream? Like, I've never seen it live at all. But I'm like, dude, it's had to have happened. Like, real life just happens sometimes, you know? Also, what am I looking for? The forgotten codex? Where's where's my guide here, man? Says the freaking guy who says no guides. That's about right. All right. Let's find our codex, I guess. Let's find this stupid thing. Okay. Okay. Maybe I should also read the quest text, right? I never do that. That would probably be a good place to start. Scholar Mortar and tells of forgotten tells of a forgotten codex in the lost archives. I should find it. Okay, so it's just we're on a scavenger hunt. I got it. Love me some of those. Someone posted something in the chat on Diablo that I find to be very questionable. And it might just be me, but I'm not quite sure. I'm not repeating it. I got to leave it up to you guys to determine what that could be. Atlas, every 10 likes, do something special for us weirdos. <laughs> like getting a bloody nose or blowing my nose on stream. Sick. You guys make this easy. Blood God, blood good or blood God? I'll take blood God. Blood good. I don't know about that. Blood doesn't actually get me like queasy or anything, but I'm not a big fan of like over gore situations. Like when I was in high school and we had to donate blood, like I was the type of person where like with my friend, we would squeeze the ball they give you to get you flowing, basically. And we would like squeeze it and race each other race each other to see who could fill up the bag quicker. It's like speed running blood donation. And uh, I mean, honestly, it's not a bad thing. You're doing something good. And so like I can handle something like that, like needles or getting shots. But if it starts to be like open wounds, that's where I'm like in rough in like way too rough of shape to be able to handle it. Come on. Every every 10 likes. By the way, speaking of, I mean, I'm not going to hold myself to it, but I won't say for sure I won't do anything weird at 10 likes. But you guys, remember to like that stream. Because if we get 10 likes, you never know what can happen. And if you're on freaking Twitch, remember to follow the stream. Because uh, you never know what can happen. We might be doing weird stuff. Community-led weird stuff. But there is a line. There's always a line. We will not be known. I am not making a name for myself as the guy who did weird things on stream. It's not happening. No, no, no. I am not that desperate, okay? All right, what do we got going on here? Oh, right, I was like maxing out my first. Wait, does this mean I need to add points here to open this or can I add them anywhere? Let's see, so it's at two right now. Let's see, I'm going to do more for the Hydra because it's sick. Okay, it could be anywhere. Sick. And listen, I've seen the things people do on streams through like VODs or like on YouTube because they're desperate for those views. No, no, no. You will not find me wearing green screen booty shorts and playing games off my booty. It's not happening. Okay. We will do the, the friendly old harmless. I don't, I don't even know. I don't even know. Weird is, is a widely defined word. So I'm opening up a can of worms with that one. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This is it. This is it, right? Forgotten Codex. Let's go, baby. Oh, my God. I can't even do that voice. Let's see. Can I do the fool's voice with my, the way I'm working right now? Um, hold on. 
Gotta gotta remove some of the nose clutter. Okay. Fools. <laughs> oh god, it kinda hurts to do. Fools! Not too bad though. We're that should be my benchmark. If I can do the fool's line on stream, I can stream. That's all that matters. Okay, okay. I wonder if we get... Oh, last stand. What is this? A little event here? I can live with that. Okay. We're doing pretty good right now. Get that fire shield on. Dude, wrecking him. Where's my delete key? Because that's all I'm doing to him. Okay. Okay. Honestly, not even hard, dude. Where is my freaking challenge? Especially considering I don't even have to, like, move all that much. Tell me, like, remind me that this game can be hard. I mean, I know it can't. Oh, God, I'm dying. I know it can be an end game, but like, my God, this feels way too easy right now. <laughs> I'm like doing all the weird noises. Did I accidentally unmute that? Uh, now I'm just, I'm going full, full sick mode on you guys. All right. I think I can finally safely leave. Um, let's see. What do we got here? Um, Extraction and imprinting. No, wait, where is this? Oh my god, my like eyes cannot handle where that just... Oh wait, oh, here it is, here it is. Okay, we gotta go here. We are going to complete this quest, however many freaking checkpoints it has. My gosh. Alice, maybe go to a hospital? No. <laughs> I probably sound way worse than I actually feel. I have plenty of energy. What else? Wait. Last year, you saw a bone of someone's hand who had a working accident? Oh, God, Atlas. No. See, that would put me over. That would, that would put me over the edge. Deez, you in a white t-shirt and it's cold brew soaked? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I already, like, I want a jumpsuit at work just for that. Just for that. <laughs> he was like, what do I have to do? <laughs> oh, that's what you're saying. You're not saying I should go to the hospital. I was reading this out of order. What do I have to do with my, my bony, you know, fingers coming out of my hand? Listen, when you have six fingers because your bone is sticking out, like, yeah. Go to the hospital for the love of God. Um, okay, where are we going? Hold on, we're doing... Where's Foxy when you need him? We got to do the, uh, the good old water break, the hydration break. Somebody's got to take the role that Foxy does when, uh... Especially when I'm sick and I'm sounding like this right now. Oh, baby. All right. Feeling like brand new for the moment. All right, let's go. Uh, wait, do we actually need to check out our inventory? Yes, we do. Would you look at that? We probably have so many freaking upgrades. Um, wait, where are the people, dude? I see a forge. Oh, it's this person. Um, all right, let's see what we got here. It's been a little while since we checked up on this. Um, plus one rank to Hydra on this helm. Wait, I think ours is already better. Yeah, it is. Already is. Let's see, 12 intelligence on this dagger. The staff. 4.1 resistance to all elements. What's this one? 3.5 total armor. 5.5 movement speed. 16 thorns. Remind me what thorns are, guys. Is that like when you get hit and it's like damage deflected? Or reflected, I should say? I forget what that one is. Um, This wand... No, our wand is still way better. Okay, I guess this is all... Ooh, 10 strength. That's what we need as a sorcerer. Wait, what does strength do for us? Armor? Honestly, might not be a bad thing. All right. Yeah, I think we can get rid of this stuff. Get rid of that. That. And that. I cannot salvage that. 
Wait, what do you mean? I don't know what just happened there, but that's fine. All right, let's go freaking complete this quest finally. At least hopefully. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Let's freaking go. Let's see, what are we? All right, we're like two and a half hours in the stream. I'm going to try and hit three hours tonight, guys. That's what I'm doing. Because I also don't want to stop playing Diablo. Not that there's like anything stopping me from not playing it on stream. Is someone there? But I need to eat after this too. I need to like take care of my my fragile self in the state I am in. You know, yes. anybody got good uh, yes, cold foods, sick foods that you would recommend? Finally, I am bound by my words. D's. <laughs> you shall know the magic Shift is compare. You think? Book. Is our or we Atlas? Come, I have prepared for this ritual. Weak, Izard, what's weak? What is weak? My voice? Yes. Agreed. My abilities in this game? Absolutely not. I'm a freaking champion right now. Uh, wait, what are we doing? As usual, I, I listened to what he had to say for about a split second. Ooh, that's the like crazy thing with colds is like respiratory wise, I feel like complete trash. But physically, I actually feel pretty good. Alright, what do we got here? Let's light them. Oh, this is... Th I was born for this. Let's go. Burn them up. <laughs> Wait, did I just, like, expedite his voice lines from clicking them? Looks like some of these pages are damaged. No matter. Give me the monster. Give me the monster. Let's go. Let's go. Are you sure that's wise? <laughs> it's always wise. Trust the guy in the basement casting rituals that look like this. Always. Oh, great powers of the elemental forces, guardians of the hidden gates. I call to you in the names of the divine and infernal powers that you would hear us and obey. We just freaking. You have to take a firm hand. We expedited the 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 tissue. And we are ready to go. We are ready to go. No. Come on. Come on. There it is. There it is. Let's go. Time to shine. I popped everything all at once, as one does. We don't manage our skills or mana. We just use everything all at once. Come on. Easy. 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 I can literally, one hand, one hand, watch this, watch this. I, I need nothing else right now. Eyes closed, eyes closed. What's going on? That was it. See, I told you. Play that for your children. I don't know so they could see what greatness looks like. Atlas tea with honey, that is the key. The key. All this I've got the tea, but there's no honey in it, though. It's also getting lukewarm, which doesn't feel great. Wait, with lime, Atlas? Tea with lime? Okay, this is why I ask you guys these things. Has anyone tried tea with lime? Is that a thing? Like, I know lemon, so I guess lime kind of makes sense. And lime is way more intriguing to me, because lime, to me, is way better than lemon. That's my thing. I don't know. Green is green is better than yellow, guys. What can I say? Wait, did we just finish that quest? Ooh, yeah, we got this. Wait. Ooh, it's a focus too. Oh man, we do want that. We do want that. Oh my god, we're gonna be doing so much damage now. Sick. Honestly, that was worth the uh the quest running. I'd say. Let's go back to Kyovis Shed. See if we can upgrade anything. Oh my god, we gotta hit level 20 too. We have to hit level 20. Even if my voice, as you can hear, gives out tonight. We will hit level 20. I will do it in front of you all. This is the price I'll pay. This is what greatness looks like. That is the theme of this stream. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, what do we got here? Rings and amulets. I should probably salvage this, actually. Oh, we can't talk to the jeweler until level 20. Obviously, duh. Been there, done that. Uh, let's salvage this, and let's get out, and let's get to level 20. Let's freaking go. Okay. 
Magic. Bada boom. I, I'll be back, sir. I will be back. Look at this, dude. Look at this freaking guy. That's going to be us, except the magical cooler version. Better freaking believe it. All right. All right. Let's see what we can do as a little side quest, maybe. Uh, let's go here. That's what's closer. We also have to focus on like what I can go to and not die. Uh, let's do this one. Because there's also another quest we can hand in. Wait, someone invited me to their party. What is going on? Is that one of you? Are you AJ? One of you? Is our beast? I know. You know. No. No, I'm not that narcissistic. I'm no beast. I'm a moderately aggressive animal in the kingdom of animals. That's, that's who I am. You know? Not too high, not too low, guys. Right in the middle. Gotta be modest. All right. Let's uh, hand in a couple of these quests and hope we hit level 20 here. I've returned with your payment, so, sir. The deed is done. This is how you pay somebody back. I knew you would prove worthy of my trust. Play my, sure my revisit to the freaking Queen's Sun and Dragon's space. Dogma. You don't pay somebody back 20%. You pay them back 100%. As one should. Ooh, what's that? Leather doublet. Ooh, okay. Okay. Oh, it has less cold resistance, but more armor. What is our resistances and stats even looking like? Oh, we have so much to spare. Oh my god. Yeah, let's do that. Nice. Looking like a true champion. I guess our outfit didn't change, did it? All right, let's get on our horse and let's go. Wait, where is it? I thought it. Oh, here it is. Here it is. We're good. We're good. I sound like I smoked 12 or 12 packs of cigs now. Not not just one, not 12 cigs individually. Tw freaking, oh my God. I had a phase back when I was younger smoking cigarettes. And I, even then I didn't sound like this. That's when you know. That's when you know the cold has gotten you. I mean, it doesn't help that I'm freaking talking to you guys for two hours straight. But you know what? I can't hold back. You know, it's like one of those things where... I wouldn't know what to do with myself if I was streaming with you guys and wasn't talking nonstop. I wouldn't even know. Alice, who doesn't stop at traffic lights? You'll... <laughs> I, I, love, I love when you guys start connecting the dots here on these conversations. All right. I do have a task at hand, though, because literally my voice actually might give out. It's fine, though. I don't need it in the rest of my life. I can just navigate... You know, as one does. But let's focus on hitting level 20 here. So I have to slay the Night Hunters and three of them. I can probably do that, considering this game is easy. Child's play, even, dare I say. But while I do still have a voice, and while we do about to hit level 20 here, as I mentioned earlier, and as someone else even mentioned, hit that like button, subscribe, follow on Twitch, guys. I'm going to have some new content hopefully out next week. I actually did want to record a video this weekend, but obviously the voice is pending on that. So we'll see. And what are you guys thinking of Diablo 4? Are you guys going to return to Diablo 4 upon Season 4? Or have you fully abandoned it? And I will say now, next week, we will be returning to Last Epoch since we missed it, unfortunately, on Wednesday. And we will be returning to my Rune Master Mage as well. Oh my god, these guys came out of nowhere, dude. Um, and I'm excited about returning to Last Epoch on my Rune Master Mage with you guys because you guys are going to see some progression I've made. Because honestly, I'm probably going to play more of it this weekend. And we are at level 80 now. And we're starting to get into the good endgame stuff. So I'm excited to share that all with you guys. I get by with my looks. No, no, no. You can't feed a streamer's ego, Deez. That's not how it works. You got to take their ego and crush it into the ground. You have to make them earn it. You know? That's not how this works. Make me earn everything. <laughs> oh, God. The voice is cracking. Deez, you'll try the new season. 
It's not easy, it's just me. Oh my gosh. The kindness comes out. I love it. Um, Honestly, I will say, speaking of it's not easy, it's just me. I do feel like I'm actually just genuinely getting better at the games I'm playing, which is, I think, just a product of playing more. So thank you guys for indulging me and hopefully enjoying your time um, with these streams because, uh, yeah, like my, my hobby is officially revitalized and I'm really having an awesome time. Hence why we're trying to add that third stream a week. I literally am going to have to start like taking voice lessons after this, guys. It's crazy. Luckily, my partner, she sings and does uh, voice, so I don't have to go far for that. But I don't know if there's anything that they can do for me uh, with the voice I've got right now. Woohoo, three quarters of the way. Let's go. Wait, why was I walking down the stairs? So weird there. Unsanctified reliquary. Okay. Dude, I love having them in a corridor and then placing down that wall of fire. That feels so good. I feel like, like I said, it's the fun thing to hate on Diablo and Blizzard right now, but... I'm not hating my experience in returning here. Maybe I was just meant to play a sorcerer. I don't know. But this does feel good so far. I will play this off stream more so I can also see how progression feels further. And uh, I'll get back to you guys on, on how I'm feeling about it. It might be a little premature to start before season four, but I honestly just didn't want to wait. I don't have time for that. I want to get right into it when I think about it. All right, cool. We got to find two boxes on the floor again, of course. You forgot you have to be mean. Oh, yeah, that's that's it's the MO, guys. There's no kindness. I keep asking for the hate. The uh, the soft level of hate, that is. The comforting hate. We can we can uh, create that here in this small community we've got. We can make the world see that you do not feed streamers. Narcissi narcissicity? Egotisticality? I'm gonna make up words now. I mean, some streamers can handle it, but not a lot. I feel like some of the top streamers are the top streamers because they are narcissists. And I'm like, that's okay. I don't have to be a top streamer. That's, that's not... That's not it. If that's the cost. All right, let's pick up our little box here. I imagine it's like a little uh, jack in the box, you know? Probably a clown in there to really spook me. You should also steam. Like, oh yeah, like steam, like get a humidifier or something. I used to, my parents used to do that for me when I was a little youngin. I feel like that totally helps. I do have a humidifier too, so. Totally will help. You know what will also help? Not constantly talking with you guys. And would you look at that? Oh, God, that was the end of me right there. Hold on. We have to finish this quest, though. I'm already this far. I'm pushing the pylon back. For better or for worse. All right, let's do it. Let's get our little box. Let's put it on the freaking pedestal. Let's get in there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, I didn't expect it. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I thought I died there, but I hit the wrong button. Dude, I honestly can't wait to listen back on this VOD to see what I sound like. I mean, I could kind of hear it myself, obviously, but... It's always different when you hear yourself recorded. What a treat this is going to be. A nice little nightcap of entertainment, you know? Just laughing at yourself. Anybody else enjoy such things? Uh, let's see. Oh, we need one more. One more. Nice. Alright, let's put our box on the pedestal. Let's move on. Wait, what's this? Hidden chest. Very nice. Very nice. I'm pretty sure this just unlocks even further to go, but that's fine. That is fine. Call this the Iron Man streak. 
the esophagus Iron Man streak. Come on, come on. See, the best part is, here's the thing. If I lose my voice, guys, I don't actually need my voice to, like, work my day job or anything. It just means I don't have to talk to people. So, you know, talking about a win, a win-lose situation, I, I would take the win in, in that. I, it's a nice little trade-off. Wait, where, where am I going? Wait, did I, do I have what I need? Oh, no, it's just asking me to do that instead. Um, wait, what was I doing here? Hold on. Whatever, we're going to complete this. Right? Yeah, 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 we're not leaving. We got to finish this freaking crypt. Crypt of the Unsung. That's very fitting, considering I definitely can't sing right now. Let's go. Like, you would think in my years of doing scream vocals in a metal van that I'd be just fine to scream right now, but you would be mistaken. You actually need a... Uh, all the abilities you would need to sing, you're just projecting them a lot more aggressively. Ooh, we got a shrine in here. We don't get many of these now. Oh, it's another greed shrine. Mask your enemies for spoils of gold. Let's go. Ooh. Come on. Take them out. Take them out. I wish there was hordes of enemies, though. There's literally two guys here, though. Oh, here, here we go. This is it. This is our moment. I love how this game is throwing so much gold at us. Like, does it ever become an issue? Because right now I can't see it. Uh, let's open these gates, get everybody in here. Nice, dude. Freaking nice. All right, we are literally rich. If only I could translate this to real life. One of these days. One of these days we'll win that lotto. That scratchy. Anybody play a scratch off ticket? I feel like the last time I did one of those was when I was like 18. Wait, the child's call. Oh God. Oh, hey, oh, out of here. Wow, we literally melted them, dude. No pun intended. Like what the heck just happened? That was way too easy. Am I just like super over leveled? Like what's happening? All right, does that mean I'm done here? No, wait, no, there's more to go. There's more to go. And I don't have to talk to my partner, Atlas. Very nice. Yeah, I'll let you tell them that. <laughs> oh my god, wait, we're facing a boss. Wouldn't you know it? What's going on here? Uh, toss that wall on him. That's right. It's like after spending hours streaming and they want to hang out and I'm just like, oh, sorry. I actually use my voice on on the uh, people in chat tonight, so I'm I'm out of commission. That that'll go over really well, you guys. <laughs> but honestly, it's already the damage is already done, so I guess you know. I'll report back. If you guys don't see me next week, you're gonna know something something happened, and you could tie it back to this very this very moment. Uh, okay. Easy, easy. I'm already at full life. Exactly, that's my point. <laughs> I'm just proving a point trying to use that potion at full health. All right, uh, sick. We unlocked something, great. All right, let's get the heck out of here, dude. Where are we going? Sanctuary, let's go to Kiova Shed. Ooh, baby. I can't even do like a high pitch like, ooh. <laughs> oh my gosh. And also, interestingly enough, if you guys want a real uh, form of entertainment, I bet if you watch this VOD back on YouTube, you could see the progression of my voice go. Like watch it back on two times speed. You're gonna be like, what the heck? This guy's crazy, dude. Oh my gosh. But, but I have to actually be serious about this now, guys. This is the end of the stream. Honestly, I really would be going for so much longer. It's Friday night, guys. This is usually the night to celebrate fun things on the Kintsugi stream. However, as you can hear <laughs> and visually see, I've got literally tissues next to me. This must be the conclusion, unfortunately. But 
I appreciate you all for sticking around. I appreciate all you who wished me well when I said I was sick the other day. So love having you guys around. All the positivity, even though I'm asking for a little bit of that negativity. It's joking, but also, seriously, don't treat streamers like they're everything, you know? I'm just a guy in my bedroom playing games with you guys. And that's how it's always going to be. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's about it. I'm not going to try and drag this one for too long, hence the voice thing. But have a great weekend, everybody. I'm going to work on getting well. I might even try that, that, what was it, the lime and tea atlas? I think you said that. So have yourselves a great weekend. I'll be on the Discord. Even though I can't vocally talk, I can type. So let's hang out there. If you guys have anything more you want to say or if you haven't joined yet, join our Discord. That is in, I think, Twitch and YouTube descriptions. So check that out. And uh, we'll be back next week. If my voice is okay by Monday, we might be streaming as soon as Monday. Otherwise, it will be Wednesday with Last Epoch. So... Be well, everyone. Better than me, I hope. And uh, have a great night. See you guys.